heat is on, mga kasambahay, as we give you the last play date dito sa ating quarterfinals round ng UNTV Cup Season 9. Ito po ang nag-iisang liga ng mga public servants. My name is Rina Villamor, camera, who will bring you the side stories, inside stories, and entertainment later on. And we welcome you right here at the Nova Desi Convention Center. Ito na po ang ating game schedule for this afternoon. Sa unang game po natin dyan, magaharap po dyan ang kupuna ng PNP responders contra sa OPPMS. On our second game, we have the NHA Home Masters going up against the GS. IS Furies. At para naman po sa ating executive face of mamaya, magaharap po dyan ang kupuna ng OP executives versus the Senate Sentinels. This three exciting ball games right here at the Nova Desi Convention Center. So please join us kung malapit lang po kayo dito sa ating venue. At this point, let's have a short recap dun sa ating mga games last Sunday, April 16. Let's take a look on those games. Sa ating unang game po dyan, nanalo po dyan ang kupuna ng PNP responders contra sa GSIS Furies with the scores 84 to 66. At tinanghal po nating best players of that ball game, Sina Olan Umiping and of course, Jafet Kabahog, both with 26 points and 12 points respectively. Now on to our second game, we have the OPPMS and the NHA Home Masters. Nanalo po dyan ang OPPMS ng 81 to 67 naman po dyan. Si Roderick Abalos with 9 points at si Paul Carbajal with 16 points ang tinanghal po nating best players of that ball game. On to our executive face-off, we have the Judiciary Magis winning against the GSIS Furies with the scores 79-51. to 51. At si Justice Midas Marquez at si Judge Wendell Ramitere po ang ating best players of that ball game. Ngayon, silipin naman po natin ang ating updated team standings dito sa ating quarterfinals round. Still number one, we have the NHA Home Masters who has 7-4 on their win-loss record. Desinusundan po sila ng OP PMS Trail Blazers also with 7-4 on their win-loss record. Ang PMP responders po, meron po silang 6-5 at ang GSIS Furies with 5-6 on their win-loss record. Now on to our executive face-off team standings naman po dyan. Kung saan ang OP executives, PNP responders, AFP Cavaliers, at Judiciary Magis. Silang apat pong kupunan, may 1-0 dun sa ating win-loss record. Also, we have the GSIS Furies and Ombudsman Graftbusters with 0-2 on their win-loss records. And the Senate Sentinels who will see action for today's ball game. Yan po. At dahil Sunday po ngayon, the happy news is that you can watch us live on the UNTV channel. And of course, sa YouTube channel din po ng UNTV News and Rescue with now 3 million subscribers and counting. And you can also get almost live updates doon sa ating Facebook page. At this point, ready na po yung ating first two teams for today's action. We have the PNP Responders and the OPPMS. Good luck to both teams. I'll turn things over to Sir Eric Tipan and to Coach Ronnie Magsana. Maraming salamat, uh, Rina Villamor Camara. Eric Tipan, kasama si Coach Ronnie Magsana. Very interesting final day ng quarterfinals today, Coach Ronnie. Tatlong team pa po ang buhay for that chance to go to the semifinals. Samantalang nag-aantay naman sa semifinals, ang number one ranked team papasok sa semis at yan ay ang team ng judiciary at ang AFP na parehong nakalusot safely in the final four. Tama ka, tatlo sa apat ng mga teams are still in contention for the last two spots. Wala na pong GSIS. So balit ang OPPMS, ang PNP at ang team ng NHA will try to find the last two slots entering the final four. And looking good to make it to the final four so far are the Home Masters and the Trail Blazers Merong backdoor way para sa PNP, but they have to win by oh, by seven or more points today. Laban sa OPPMS to rekindle their hopes alive of still going the home masters doon sa semifinals. Kung mag-tie po yan lahat sa 7-5, yung top three teams, wala na pong playoff. There's a quotient system. Pag-usapan right. po namin yan maya-maya throughout the game. Pero ngayon, kinalayan na po na natin ang lineup ng parehong uh, kapunan OPPMS at PNP. Good afternoon and welcome to the Nova Desi Convention Center for the first of our Sunday's triple header in Season 9 quarterfinals of the UNTV Cup, Ang Liga ng Public Servants. Let's a welcome in first your PNP responders. Number 0, Gerald Dia. Number 2, Rolly Serrano. Number 4, Olan Umiping. Number 5, Darwin Guzman. Number six, Anton Tolentino. Number seven, Abul Kair Bayabao. Number nine, Hili Aniban. Number 17, Jayman Misola. Number 24, Richard Villanueva. Number 22, Mark Nicolas. 
Number 28, Marvin Enriquez. Number 34, Francis Abaya. Number 44, Harold Desena. Number 48, Japet Kabahug. And number 55, Serge Maseren. Their head coach is Julius Manalo. First assistant coach is Sherwin Mandiola. Assistant coach is Ernie Santa Cruz. Now, give it up for your OP PMS Trail Blazers. Number 8, John Aljard. Number 10, David Lau. Number 12, Paul Carbajal. Number 13, Roderick Abalos. Number 15, Sigfred Reyes. Number 17, Enur Macapagal. Number 18, Limon De Los Santos. Number 23, Chris Dalatin. Number 24, Brian Gabriel. Number 25, John Maverick Estabillo. Number 34, Ben Sar Balagtas. Number 37, Roman Ramos. Number 70, Eric Manalo. Number 77, Robert Faundo. And number 99, Jericho Acedera. Your head coach is Romano Fernandez. Assistant coaches are Melvin Virgis, Jerick Galisa, and John Michael Jimenez. Let's first meet the starting five of your BNP responders. At guard number six, Anton Tolentino. The other guard number seven, Abul Kair Bayabao. At center, number 17, Jayman Mesola. At forward, number nine, Healy Aniban. In the other forward, number two, Rolly Serrano. Here now is the starting lineup of your OP PMS Trailblazers. At guard number eight, John Aljard. The other guard number 77, Robert Faundo. At center, number 12, Paul Carbajal. At forward, number 13, Roderick Abalos. In the other forward, number 23, Chris Dalatin. Appreciating this ball game are Julius Medillo, John Dave Jaramillo, and Winston Veloso. the UNTV Cup on Liga ng Public Servants. Magandang hapon po. Welcome sa Noman Desi. Simula na po ng uh, quarterfinal matchup sa pagitan ng PNP Responders at OPPMS. Must win para sa PNP. Yes. Para mga iba pa nila, mahatak nila yung standing ng OPPMS at magtapat po sila. At hindi lamang basta manalo. Manalo ng uh, oh. saktong uh, numero na napakahirap gawin. Eh. Base sa aking karanasan paglalaro at sa mga sitwasyon na ganito. Kaya habuli ka ganun. Yes. Itong si Carbajal at Abalos ang tinanghal na oh, co-best players of the game para sa team na hindi pa natatalo sa quarterfinals kasamang Eric. The only unbeaten team so far here in the quarters. Serrano, inside pass. Bisola against three defenders. Ngayon, hindi na ipasok ang bola. Maganda sana yung peke. Dalatin. O Dalatin, binababa ang bola. First quarter action. Yes! Putahan natin itong report ni Rina. Rina? Yes, sir, Eric. It's also a must-win situation para dito sa kupuna ng OPPMS. As per Coach Fernandez, walang minti sila pagdating sa pag-eensayo every Tuesday, Thursdays, and Saturdays. They are confident that they can win against the PNP team, which they also made possible the last time around, last March 5, kung saan nanalo sila against the PNP team by 6 points. The key to winning this ball game is to be consistent when it comes to their shooting and their running game. They are prepared here to stop omiping Tolentino, Cabahog, and Serrano, who was a prolific scorer on their last game. Lastly, Coach Fernandez, is so happy because of all the hard work his boys are showing. Sabi nga niya, everyone is being responsible inside the court. Sir Eric and Coach Ronnie. Maraming salamat, Rina. Uh, so far, mababawasan ang pinaproblema ng OPPMS. I don't see Olan umiping on the bench. Oo nga, no? Para sa, OP, uh, sa PNP. Yeah, tanongin natin sa ating kasamang si Rina about uh, the two-time MVP and uh, one-time MVP Cup champion is Kar Bahal. Continues to play really well. And with the return of uh, the Latin, oh, oh. the mass maruder, this all goes well para sa OPPMS. Na pwede mong sabihin, the surprise team of this season. Nice shot para kay Serrano. Who came off an eight-point performance. 
ng kanilang panalo kontra sa GSIS. 84 points scored by PNP after accounting for only 64 and that 8-point loss to the NHA Home Masters. Shot from outside. Wala. Tatapos si Serrano. It's a 3-on-2 break. Serrano nasa gitna. Goes all the way. Yes! One track mind. Attack in the open court. Get into transition lanes and score. And easy looks. Back-to-back -back baskets para kay Serrano. Lamang panandalian ng PNP pero mamawiin ng OBPMS with a basket by Abalos. This is the frontline combo that has made it possible for this team to make it their quarters and are right now only 40 minutes away from a spot in the semifinals. Yun ang importante, Coach Johnny, para sa OBPMS. A win here today assures Tapos them na. Tapos na. agad sila sa semifinals. Pero mahirap manalo, Rick, ha? Napakahirap. Especially against a team na Nang may pag-asa pa ng kailangan. Oh. Oh. At ang kanilang buffer na tinatawag ay kung hindi man sila makalusot, wag lang silang magapi ng higit sa aning na puntos. Nice pass. Dalatin. Off the glass. Yes. One of the best players here this season. Before he went down with a uh, skull injury, uh -oh. he was averaging close to 25 and getting about 10 rebounds per game. Nawala. Nakabalik at ngayon, delikado pag nakapaglaro. At ngayon, starting out for the first time. Mayabao kicks it out. Tolentino. May dos na to si Tolentino. This time, short. Serrano picks up the long ball. OBPMS, lamang ng tatlo. Misola drives wow. hard and lays it in. Anytime you're able to use the glass from the corner, that's a difficult shot. Misola. Did not score contra sa GSIS. One of the pioneers para sa PNP in the UNTV Cup. Paundo to Abalos. Yes! Ooh! When the season is on the line, the veterans normally come out really hard to play because they know how to play in these circumstances and they know how to, you know, they find ways to win. Ito si Abalos tumatakbo. Abalos! Three field goals because of first quarter. Carpahal and Abalos with 11 of the first 15 points. Frontline power, teamwork, just like that. Six point lead over the PNP. Responders. Abalos para sa OPPMS, hindi pa nagmimintis from the field, has seven points. Very impressive start. One three-point basket, two inside the incursions, and then Carvajal also doing the same. And that's also complemented by the Latin, who has accounted for four early points. So far, no estabilio inside, no problem para sa kanila. Very tall starting unit. And even our Jard, uh -oh. a uh, regular 30-point scorer who still scoreless up to now, has not come up with this basket yet. Pero sila ay lamang pa rin ang anin. Corner shot. Pasok. Basket after the timeout. Very important. As we hit the halfway mark for the six-point lead, advantage has been sliced to three. Magandang timeout yun para sa BNP Villanueva knocking in a basket. Kailangan, kailangan nila yun para hindi sila maiwanan dito sa ating first quarter. Abalos, nice hesitation. Oh, but he stepped sa uh, baseline and turns it over. Running out of space. Probably needing some uh, defensive adjustments sa itong uh, PNP as they shifted from man-to-man -man defense to a 2-3 zone. 
Basta puntahan natin itong report ni Rina regarding the bench ng PNP. Rina? Yes, uh, let's talk about Ola Numiping who just arrived inside the dugout. No, pinuntahan ko nga siya doon at nakakwentuhan ko siya. Sabi niya na flatan daw siya ng motor kaya na late daw siya dito sa ating uh, venue. Nagpa-vulcanize pa daw siya at medyo natagalan daw yun. Hindi pa siya nakakapag-lunch actually. Pero sabi niya nga sa akin, sasabak na siya. Uh, magpapalit lang siya ng kanyang uh, uniform at this point. So let's hope and pray that Ola Numiping uh, will contribute big para dito sa kupa ng PNP responders. Eric, back to you. Great report. Maraming salamat, Rina. That's good news, Coach Ronnie, para sa fans at para sa PNP responders. All in the big, ready to come in. Lalong-lalo na after the timeout, may naitablan na nila yung talaan sa 15 more. Maragang surge na sana para sa mga nakapula. The two three-point baskets negates that six-point deficit earlier. Abalos, his first miss, pero may foul na itinawag. He will shoot free throws. There's a ton of pressure on the side of the PNP. But anytime you have your number one player in harness, the confidence level will definitely spike. So Abalos with seven points. This is the first free throw. Ito ay uh, the bank shot master. <laughs> Sabi mo nga, Coach, mahirap to, no? Subukan mo, Rick. Yung nga lang maipasok ko lang. <laughs> Hindi yung papatamain sa board. May mahirap na yung pag aasintahin mo yung square. Mahirap yan. Mahirap. May circle ka na rim, tapos may square, may square ka naman. So dadal- dalawa yung tatansahin mo? Si Barney na kasunod yan. <laughs> Tolentino. Fakes. Galing. Tolentino steps in. Mintes. Big rebound and basket. Para kay Nicolas. Full court press para sa PNP. It's a two-on-one result para sa OPPMS and Abalos once again. Two games ago, yeah. I believe uh, 18 points and 20 rebounds. In the last game, together with Carbajal, they secured the most rebounds, but more than that, scored in double figures as well. And right now, he has the double-digit production already. That's 10 of the first 18 points. Perfect from the field for Abalos. Abaya, pinabantaya ni Paundo, inikot kay Tolentino. Abaya with a fake, Abaya drives hard, nice defense by Carvajal. Bakbakan sa inalim, and Nicolás steps out of bounds. Finally a defensive stop for the red shirts after three consecutive baskets para sa PNP. Full court press, muli para sa PNP. And Paundo trapped. Was in trouble momentarily. Naipasa ang bola. Carbajal nasa gitna. Nice pass. Abalo sa ilalim. Pinalik. Very tight passing. Carbajal rejected. Tolentino. Nakawala. Tolentino. Out of control. Loses the ball. Aljard. Pinasa sa baba. Abalos. Ooh. Little hesitation. Abalos. Taken big. Travels. Some bully basketball on the part of Abalos. But that connection will not count. Sayang, dosen na sana siya at tatlo na muli ang kanilang kalamangan. Na parami yung uh, hakbang. Pero merong starters step at head and shoulder thing. Maganda tingnan. <laughs> Kahit and si Commissioner Ate ko na <laughs> natuwa. It's a move ni uh, Abalos. Abalos with the defensive rebound. Al Jard to Paundo. Paundo spots up. Da- Three. Certainly not the last for one of the best three-point gunners this season. Itong si Faundo coming off a 13-point performance. Three of six from the three ball last time they played. Apat kalabangan ngayon na OPPMS. Desena sa ilalim is fouled. He will shoot two free throws. Substitution para sa OBPMS si Papa Hingam si Abalos who's been so productive sa lang in double digits with 10 points para sa parehong kopunan. Good pace set by Abalos and Carbajal. Ramos papasok para kay Abalos. Desena at the line. Magaling na second wheel player itong si Ramos. You always find ways to help out. In so many opportunities, or rather, in so many other facets of the game, na kaya niyang umambang. 
The center misses both, picks up his own miss. Not pala kasung layup attempt. And Sarano puts back the miss. Without Abalas inside, really talaga itong red shirts. But so far, they have been able to stay afloat. Ito si Ramos, binali kay Carvajal. Almost traveled. Pinikot ang bola. Drive to the basket. Ramos sa ilalim. Yes! That's the pass. We always work. Hard to defend. A team that is so unselfish. Villanueva in traffic. Dalawa bumantay sa kanya. He is fouled. Another set of free throws para sa uh, PNP. Three team fouls na para sa OPPMS. Only one team foul sa PNP. Next week, tapos lang April. Kasama ngayon. Oo. Oh. Mayo na. Mayo na. Bilis. And speaking of May, May 3, Coach Ronnie, ano, magsisimula ang ating semifinals as Villanueva. Ay. That's it. Pagdating ng Mayo, tayo na sa Antipolo. <laughs> oh, nice deal. Napakagandang five-point swing para sa PNP. Sarano high-fives Villanueva. Uh, PNP ties the game at 23 with 110 remaining in sa ating first quarter. Babalik tayo sa Nova Desi para sa last quarter final game ng UNTV Cup Season 9. Estabillo is pressured by Abaya. Paundo. Tres. Yes, back-to-back threes para kay Paundo. Uh, the give OPPMS a three-point lead, 26-23. Their own version of a basket after a timeout. Restores a one-possession lead. Pero si Nicolas pasagot on the other side. Some problems sa inside defense ng uh, OPPMS. Masyadong madali. Ang puntos ng PN Perito. And uh, this is to- a total of 51 points by these two teams combined. Yeah. Hindi naman, hindi matibay ang depensa, kundi napakataas lang ng kanilang porsyon to pareho. Lalo na OPPMS, Coach Ronnie, 91%. 11 of 12. <laughs> Isa lang ang minutes. And dahil lang kay Abalos, Abalos is 4 of 4. Nasa, uh, nasa bench ngayon si Abalos, nagpapahinga. Estabillo, open. A rare miss para sa OPPMS. A steal by Paundo. Samantalang ang PNP ay 58% po from the field. Napakaganda rin numero niyan. Oh, stepping on the sideline si Paundo. Turnover. That's good transition defense for the white shirts. 14.2 seconds remaining in the first quarter. Uh, final shot time para sa PNP and they can take the lead going to the second quarter. Abaya, nakakita ng butas. A little up and under move. Wala. Pinapik palabas. Desena ang bola. Napunta kay Estabillo. Estabillo with time. Estabillo drives. No! At uh, the buzzer, dahil nag-mintis parehong kapunan, OBPMS will take a one-point lead going to the second quarter. Abalos with 10 leading scorer para sa OBPMS. Samatalan si Sarano with 8 is a top scorer para sa PNP.
26-25 OBPMS contra sa PNP. The loser dito, uh, well, depending on sino matatalo, kung ang uh, PNP matatalo, tanggal na po sila sa uh, quarterfinals and uh, tapos na po ang kanilang season 9. Pero kung matatalo OBPMS, dapat ang laman ng PNP is 7 points or more para may pag-asa na po silang umakyat to the semifinals. Uh, Paundo misses on the first shot into the second quarter. Offensive rebound. Carmahal, Paundo tries again, knocks it again. Three three-point baskets for Faundo. Uh -huh. That's 11 points already for Faundo. He's missed only once so far. And this is a team that shot 78% in the first quarter. Ganda ng inilalaro ng key players sa OBPMS. Villanueva misses. Estabillo, uh, may pushing foul na itatawag. Uh, natulak niya ng bahagya si Enriquez to get the defensive rebound. Ano magiging susi dito para sa PNP coach Johnny with their defense? They have to stop Paundo from outside at si Abalos, you know, inside. Although Abalos not yet in the starting lineup to the second quarter. Nalang susi dito para sa kanila, although they're playing quite well sa unit. May makapasok si Olo ng meeting kasama ngayon. Eh, nakikita ko na. Hindi na, nag-overlap up na. Oo, kasi kailangan talaga yung experience at yung leadership ng Olo ng meeting. At mahalaga rin na may paalala sa kanya yung margin of victory na kailangan nila. Oo, napanalo. Seven points or more. So, definitely, if it's a close game, Coach Ronnie, at around two-minute mark, eh, hapit ka na nun. Mahirap, mahirap. Enriquez puts it in. Importante rito talaga, gang-ho ka eh. Kaya inaangat nila yung offense nila, Rick. Dapat mabilis, ano? Yes. And uh, sa lagay na ito, kanina pa sila nag-ahabol, uh, OPPMS, they've been shooting so well. Kaya, uh, talaging na, na, nasa abante o oh, nasa kalamangan ng OPPMS. Kabahog in the game, Estabillo, the pass na tapik ni Desena, turnover para sa OPPMS, Kabahog. Serrano drives, puts it in. Eight first quarter points, but first, plus first basket here in the second. The deficit is just down to one para sa PNP. Close game ulit. Pero si Paudo, kailangan matutukan to. He's been knocking in three. Al Jard, mula sa labas. Yan ang concern ko eh. Kasi after 10 minutes, si Al Jard, yan ang unang tira niya. Walang touches para kay Al Jard. Mahirap yan. Nice passing. Layup short para kay Serrano. But offensive rebound to Sena. Serrano has it back. Bayabao drives. Blocked from behind by Estabillo. Paudo, hawak ang bola. Uh, great transition defense para sa PNP. Desena, double teaming Paundo. Nice pass. Aljard open. Aljard three. Wala pa rin. Big rebound para kay Serrano. Mayabao. Finds an opening and gives the PNP responders the lead. That's poor transition defense on the part of... Uh, Executives. Incidentally, si Cabajo. Isa sa tinuring natin na best player. Ang best player last week. After shutting down Maki Escalona. Aljard. Papawe. After missing two threes, naipasok niya yun and gives the lead right back sa OPPMS by two. He needs to take shots. He's the best scorer in the competition. Nearly 30 points per game itong si Aljard. He has to keep taking shots. Kaya pinapainit talaga nila na binibigyan nila ng touches. Kabaho. Lalabas ulit ang bola. Bayabaw hinihingi from the corner. No more time. Shot clock violations for the PNP. Pinabanggit natin kanina yung matinting pressure sa side ng PNP. I believe ganun din sa OPPMS eh. Kasi sabi mo unbeaten ka. One or rather three quarters away from a spot sa semis, tapos pag nagkamali ka, ikaw pa ang hindi makakaluso. Kasi superior ang quotient ng NHA. NHA. Ano man ang mangyari, kung mag-triple time man. Oo. Na 7-5. Estabilio. This is the mark. Pagkakataon, si Tai as Umiping is in the game for the first time. Umiping sa ilalim. Tai is the game. 32 all. Kulang sa pasnaan dito ang OPP. May factor ay good. First ball, first start. Wow. With contact. 
Aljar puts it in. It will not count though. Sabi ng ating referee. So sideline inbound. Para kay Aljar. Enriquez lalabas. Misola papasok. Ang malaking kalamangan ay anin no? kanina para sa OPPS. Sa PNP, isa o dalawa. Abalos is back in the game. Aljard spots up. Wala. Layo na. Parang nagmamadali parati yung OPPMS. Ano? Oliping saves it but gives it up kay Dalatin. Steal by Kabahog. Oliping nasa ilalim. Three against one. Bayabaw misses the point blank range shot. Masakit yun para sa PNP. Aljard passes Estabillo. OPPMS. Can take the lead here. We're tied at 32. Estabillo short. Again, no extra pass. And that's a travel. Good defensive play coming from Galate. Ang bilis ng parehong offense sa Coach Ronnie. Sino ba? Condition na condition na. Hindi ba papabori ang ganyang klaseng pace sa OPPMS para sa akin? Kasi mas bata. 14 seconds on the shot. Tolentino is back in the game. Babantayan si Paundo. Abalos, nakaposte kontra kay Misola. Abalos, top shot. Misola, tatawagan ng kanyang first personal foul. Abalos, at the line for two. Abalos, one for two kanina. Now he's one for three. Gets it off the glass again. Para yung kaninang set ng free throws, yung pangalawa, pumasok off the glass. So, one point lead para sa OPPMS. Uh, really fast-paced game. Second quarter action, 5-32. Nalalabi. Serrano rises. Foul and one. Serrano now with a total of 12 points. Eight in the first quarter, four here in the second quarter. That's big. That's still the first 34. The running game continues para sa PNP. And perfect din to si Serrano or Coach Ronnie for the field. He is 6 for 6. Kasi lahat sa loob halos eh. Dalatin. Binabantay ng mahigpit ni Serrano. Dalatin drops it off. Abalos in traffic. What a shot. That's the difference between a one-on-one play. And a teammate was willing to give up an extra pass. Hindi ka laki yan si Abalos, Coach Johnny, pero nakakapaglaro sa ilalim, ano? Big talaga ang laro niya, Rick. Kahit malalaki yung ating kalaban, at umabantay, tapahog for three. PNP now with their biggest lead at three points, 38-35. Three-point basket number four para sa PNP. Five of nine naman. Mga mga nakapula. Both teams exceptional shooting here. In this critical match in our final play in the quarterfinals. Well, the Mwaba, ang OBPMS, Mahayano, kanina 90% yan, 60% na lang ngayon, Coach Ronnie, in the second quarter. But PNP, 59% pa rin. Nice steal from behind by Uripe. The go ahead pass kay Tolentino, no numbers para sa PNP. Aatras si Tolentino. They are protecting a three point lead. Uripe, nice pass, Kabaho, go open again. Oh! And he gets fouled shooting a three. The Latin cannot believe it. Let's take a look at that last play again. Well, did you get any the Latin coach on it? Not a trust in either the Sabaho. No, so I'm not saying that. Oh, you know, na sabita niya ng bahagya. So he will be called for a foul. Three free throws to para kay Sabaho. Gla, mamaga ng bahagya ang kalabangan dito ng uh, PNP if Kabaho knocks in all three free throws. Oh, muntis ang pangalawa. One more free throw coming. Two for three. Okay, Kabaho got the line. It's a five-point lead, the biggest para sa responders contra sa OBPNS. 15-9, second quarter scoring in favor of PNP. Again, again, 
Too much individual plays here para sa OPPMS. Kabaho, binababa ang bola. Tolentino, nice pass, umiping for three. Legal screen. Third team foul para sa PNP. OPPMS already in the penalty with four minutes remaining. Dito sa ating first half. Nakaposte. Si Aljard against a smaller defender. I like that last sequence. The Latin a willing passer. Aljard recognizing the mismatch. Kanina lima hinahabol. Ngayon bumaba. Sa tatlo. Ano ba yan? Tatlo? 40-35 eh, diba? Kanina o oh, coach. Then... Uh, Apunto si Aljard for 37. Empty possession para sa PNP. And itong OBBMS can tie with a three-pointer dito sa possession na to. Aljard for the tie, short, way short. The difference earlier, ang bantay niya si Cabahog. Ginabas si Cabahog. Si Villanueva ay mas malakas at mas matangkad. Umiping. Pinasa Villanueva sa corner. Binalik kay Umiping. Umiping for three. That's short. And Misola tried to save it pero stepping out of bounds na siya. And I think that's why si, warning si Misola dito for complaining. Oh no, the bench is one. Bench ng PNP. So, two possessions na, hindi nakapunta sa PNP dito. Uh, let's see if Estabillo and OVPMS can uh, make this game a little closer. Carbajal, setting a pick. Hindi ginamit ito latin. Three seconds on the shot clock. Aljard. Illegal pick set by Carbajal. That's an unfortunate move. Oh, wow. As Carbajal has been called for his third personal foul already. That's critical. Kasi yung rotation nito, isa dalawa lang sa front line. Oo. Oh, oh. Good ball movement dito para sa responders. Serrano. Nice pass. Villanueva open. In and out. Three empty possessions para sa responders. Pagkakataon muli para sa OBPNS. Na tubigit. Aljard. Abalos asking for it. Nice defense from behind. Para kay Umipig. Serrano tumatakbo. Serrano drives. Basket and a foul. It's a poor entry pass on the part of the OPPMS leading to this open court play. Parang napakahirap kasi bitawan ng bola para sa red shirts kung hindi sila titira. And that has gone against them. Pero sa PNP, ang bilis ng galaw ng bola. And so far, Coach Ronnie, parang uh, kaya namang i-maintain ang PNP itong pace na to. So far. Uh, there, this is now their biggest lead at 6 points. Lima kanina yung kanila biggest lead. 43-37. Well, Serrano has scored a total of uh, 16 points, if this is correct. 7 for 7 from the field. Aljard, jab step. Aljard, natapigan ng bola. Nice steal, Villanueva. Serrano natakbo, Villanueva will go all the way. Frenetic pace, intense defense, at speed para dito sa PNP. And they put up their biggest lead right now at 8 points, 45-37. Contra sa OBPMS.
Great defense leads to easy offense para dito sa PNP. And alalahanin po natin na bagkit namin ito kanina as we come to the final two minutes to the first half. Kailangan manalo ng PNP by seven points or more. And right now, lamang na sila ng walo. Aljard. Nakasto na po itong uh, PNP. Nalatin. Final five seconds on the shot clock. Nalatin loses it momentarily. Three seconds to shoot. Nalatin misses the ring. Go ahead pass. Nalatin picks it up. Steal by OBPMS. Paundo spots up. There's a foul by Serrano. And again, the willingness to pass. And give up that basketball early before the defense is set. Seems to be a question mark right now for the team. So well. Kaya hindi sila malibre dahil lahat sariling kayo. Hindi naman yan yung simula nila dahil kanina grabe magpasahan. Si Carbal at Abalos. Pero yung mga gwardiya parang may glue sa kamay yung mga bola. Yung bola. Both teams with three assists each. Zero for two. Para kay Faundo at the free throw line. Kanina-kanina pa to, hindi nakakapunto sa OBPMS. Napako na yan sa 37. It's a 20-11 count. Wow. Huwag mo na 22, coach. Tama. Eh, 20 na si Serrano. 18 na si Serrano. 8 for 8, Serrano is perfect from the field. And it's a 10-point lead now. Biggest lead by any team. Dito sa laban na ito. First double-digit lead natin in this quarter-final matchup. At si Serrano magpapahinga, rightfully so. Ang ganda ng kanyang contribution here in the first half. What about all of the meeting? Also do we to share after missing the first quarter because of a flat tire. Oh, oh. But definitely PNP playing with the Four excellent wheels. No flat tire. <laughs> even after a slow start. Kasi gumana yung mga players na ginamit kanina nung wala pa si Ola Malinti. Oo. Oh. Malatin misses. OPPMS struggling at the free throw line. Yes. Downhill later in the second quarter for them. Namang pa to kanina eh. Si... Aljar tried to save it. He could have let it go. Kasi turnover yun para sa PNP. But he tried to save it and stepped outside. They've been outscored 12-5 in the last five minutes. Uh, gonna be a foul away from the ball here. Ramos tatawagan kontra kayo umiping. So you cannot impede yung motion ng offensive player. Kung saan siya pwedeng pumunta. So, umiping, free throws. Uh, sa penalty na po ang uh, OPPMS. Nagulangan ni Olan si Ramos. <laughs> Samantala, PNP looking good at the free throw line. PNP over 50%, 5 of 11 or 6 of 11. OPPMS missing 5 free throws at well, as well, but only at, at a 37 and a half clip. Nothing but net para kay Umiping. It's an 11-point lead para sa PNP. Estabillo. Ginabantayan ni Villanueva. Paundo. Makuha bola from the handoff. Dalaten asking for it against Bayabao. Chris Dalaten. Nice move. Oh, everything but the basket. Three on three break. Tolentino spots up for rebound. Mabubuta kay Aljar. It's a two-on-one on the other side. Talaten drives with the left. And there's going to be a foul. Uh, itatawag uh, contra kay Nicolas. Harry throws, yes. With his teammate was wide open underneath earlier. I thought that that was a good foul to go by Nicolas. Talaten, kanina 50% from the free throw line. He has five points. Only seven players in action for the red shirts. 
Abalas with 13, Faunda with 11. The Latin with 5 together with Alzar. And again, splits the free throws para kay the Latin. BNP to take the final shot here. Tolentino puts it up off the miss. Would have counted kung pumasok. But still, a big second quarter para sa BNP as they put up a double digit lead. They are up by 10, 49 39, going into the third quarter. Back here for our halftime break here at the UNTV Cup Games. Ang ating halftime score po is 49 to 39 in favor of the PNP responders. At para po sa ating halftime segment, kilalaning muna natin ang mga manlalaro ng OPPMS. Talaga naman nagpamalas ng kanilang galing sa dito sa hard court sa paglalaro ng basketball and being also a public servant. Dito po sa ating heart of a champion. Of this ball game, we have uh, Robert Paundo, John Kenneth Aljard, at Chris Vincent Dalatan ang kupuna ng OPPMS. Bata pa lang ay pare-pareho ng kinahihiligan nila Chris Dalatan, Kenneth Aljard, at Robert Paundo ang paglalaro ng basketball. Uh, nung bata ko, hindi naman ako umulit. Hindi naman nakakapasa. Pero ganun pa rin, pug- puro paglalaro ng basketball. Mm. Sinasama ko ng tito ko, tapos tinuruan ako ng papa ko maglaro. Kada hapon, pagkagising sa tanghali, laro na agad sa court, punta na kahit tanghaling tapat. Kaya ganito yung kulay. Uh, yung bata pa lang ako, hilig ko na talaga basketball. Elementary ako, no? nagsushooting-shooting na talaga ako, hilig ko talaga. Tapos pagdating ng high school, nakakuha ako nung varsity nung high school sa school namin. Nagdi-dribble pa lang sa court. Pagka dati, pagka 6 a.m. pa lang, narunig mo na yung dribble sa court. Ah, gising ka na. Tara, may naglalaro ng basketball. Ayun, yun talaga. Simula umaga. Uwi lang ako sa bahay. Tangalian, kakain. Tapos mga 2 p.m. Out, basketball ulit. Uh, yun, napapadayo-dayo kami. Kung saan-saan. Nung college, uh, dami ko napuntahan school dahil sa pagbabarsity nga, palipat-lipat rin. Pag nadidispan yung team, hindi pa tulit kukunin ang ibang coaches. Pero simulat sa pool, ano, uh, player na talaga simula high school. Nagpamili ako ng maagi. Kumbaga nagtatrabaho ako sa basketball, sa mga company. Napasok kami again sa Cebu Pacific. Ganyan, kumukuha din kasi ng ano, mga player. Kaya yun, doon ako nakakapagtrabaho kami sa... Nag-ramp agent kami sa Cebu Pacific. Tapos player din. Uh, nung college, nag-aaral ako sa San Beda College, Alabang. Hindi ako nakatapos ng college eh, kasi ano rin, uh, nagka-pamilya rin ako na maaga. I have to work. 
ang basketball din ang naging daan upang makapasok sila sa Armed Forces of the Philippines. May nagsabi lang na coach ko na may open tryout sa Navy kaya niyaya ko sila na mag-tryout. Uh, ayun, napunta ako sa pagsusundalo kasi ano, uh, una nga, yun nga, nasa airport ako and then si parang Kenneth, uh, matagal na kami magkasama niyan eh, mula pababata ako na talaga. Ano, uh, iningganyan ganyan niya ako na may tryout daw sa Philippine Navy men's basketball. May tryout daw kami, baka may, kaya ko pa daw maglaro. Sabi ko, sige, subukan natin, sinubukan ko. Yun nga, nakapasa naman kami sa basketball training. Marami kami nakapasa doon. So, siyempre, another test doon is kung papasa ka naman sa exam. Ayun, nag-exam din kami. Eh, sinwerte pa rin. Pumasa ulit. Uh, may nag-ano lang na coach. Uh, pumunta kami kasi may tryout daw sa Philippine Navy ng basketball. Eh, tinaray lang namin mag-tryout. Yun, sa awa ng Diyos, nakuha naman sa tryout. Nag-exam kami, nakapasa naman. Pumasok sa isip ko nun, alam kong mahirap yung dadaan, dadaanin namin kasi sundalo. Pero yung may basketball kasi, kaya yun, tapos sama-sama pa kami magkakababata na ano, kaka-teammate. Kaya sabi namin, go na lang. Kaya yan. Kala lang namin, laro-laro lang basketball. Ayun pala, sundalo pala. <laughs> Nabigla ka. Kaya na, nag-training kami ng military training. Hindi, sa una, hindi thankful eh, no? <laughs> Kasi nagulat kami. Ang kala namin is, pinapasok namin mag-basketball lang. Siyempre, yun yung mindset mo. Okay yan, basketball. Ang duty ka, doon lang sa basketball court. Eh, yun pala, pagkatapos mo ng basketball is, hindi lang talaga pag basketball yung pinapasok mo, pagsusundalo na rin. Kaya yun nga, eh, siyempre, kaya na, ginurab na lang namin. Yun nga, magkakasama naman kami, okay na yan. O perform namin ang ano, military training, kandak, kinandak namin, 7 months, or 7 months, graduate kami yun, successful naman. Mag-graduate naman kami ng malakas, <laughs> walang nangyari. Uh, yun, tinuloy-tuloy na lang namin. Hanggang ngayon, nasa servisyo pa rin kami, napakasaya pa rin. Sa engine ako ng, ano, ng barko, sa mga damage ako, kung may mga damage yung mga barko, doon ako nakaposition. Enlisted personnel ako ng Philippine Navy uh, sa BRP ang Pangulo. Ang uh, assignment ko doon, uh, BM, Boston Street, taga-maintain ng barko, tapos pag naglaleg kami sa mga tali naman kami, ako, saka sa ano, <clears throat> steering wheel, sa throttle man, yan. yan. Pag nasa base kami, ang duty namin is nasa ano, kami, special service office. Doon kami yung mga sa mga physical fitness ng mga sundalo, kami yung nagkaandak nun. Basketball man ang nagdala sa kanila para tahaki nila ang landas ng pagiging sundalo. Hindi naman nila pinagsisisihan ang ginawa nilang desisyon dahil isa sila sa mga kawal ng bayan na nagpapanatili ng kapayapaan sa ating bansa. Sa Marawi nga nun, yung forgettable experience ko, yung na-detail kami dun sa mga namatay kami yung nagbuat doon. Tapos yung mga pamilya nandun. Yung mga family ng mga, ano, nag-aabang. Yun, napakalungkot kasi makikita mo silang naiyak, napapaiyak ka rin eh. Talagang, minsan, ayaw mo makbang kaso kailangan eh. Yun ang, mag- yun ang magiging ano mo sa kanila eh. Parang tulong mo na rin dahil kaysa ikaw yung nandun sa may gera, eh, ikaw na nandito. Pero po, may military duties mo ano meron dito sa, ano mo sa unit mo. Ah, uh, nakapag-inspire sa akin para magpatuloy sa serbisyo is, ayun, siyempre, uh, maglingkod ka sa bayan. Uh, maging insecurity ng mga uh, bawat Pilipino. Uh, yun, malaking bagay na yun, mapaglingkod mo sila in a different way as military duties. And, kung saan, kung saan man ako makasahin, sunod lang, paalo lang. Uh, sa concept ng UNTV Cup, uh, napakaganda na itong liga na ito kasi Uh, hindi ka naglalaro para sa sarili mo, sa kasatim mo. Naglalaro ka nga para sa beneficiary mo. Yun, eh, yun, dun pa lang eh, sa amin pa lang na uh, sa amin magkakampi, kaya kami nagpupush para maglaro at para manalo.
is para sa beneficiary namin. Okay, Kuya Daniel Lacazon, maraming salamat sa liga na binigay mo. Uh, hindi lang nakakatulong sa amin sa mga players na nakikilala, pero nakakatulong rin naman sa mga beneficiaries namin. Ako si Siman, first John Kenneth Aljard. John first Chris Dalaten. Siman second Robert Faundo. Ang, ang inyong public servant. servant. Sila po ang ating tampok para po sa ating Heart of a Champion. Walang iba kundi sila John Kenneth Aljard, Chris Dalaten at si Robert Faundo ng OPPMS. Now up next, we have our halftime entertainment, so don't go away. Entertainment and this portion is brought to us by KDR Music House Production. This afternoon, we have invited Atropang Lol Cantrabajo Grand Winner in Lunch Out Loud, HOPE Singer. First, a Singer of the Year in the Higher School in UMAC, a P-Pop Awardee and an Indie Artist Official Nominee. Once again, let's all welcome at Center Court, Mr. John Jacob Plaza. Ito rumbo 
So my next song is Halos Po, uh, composed by Sir Mark Mendoza. Thank you. Oh, no. 
Thank you, so thank you for joining us. You thank know, you, thank you. John, you have a very inspiring story from being a news yes. member po to being a singer. Pa, paano yung nangyari, John? Um, since it's pandemic po, natigil kami sa pagtitinda ng gyro. So, sumap, uh, nakipagsapalaran ako through online and also dumating nga sa point na lumaban ako sa isang station sa TV. Then, uh, ayun nga po, nakachamba. <laughs> na, Nag-grand champion tayo ng... Uh, sa isang station. Uh, thank you. At nagtuloy-tuloy na yun. Yes, nagtuloy-tuloy na. And ngayon, yung pera na yon hindi ko na ginasos kung saan pa. Ang ginawa ko, pinayos ko kagad ng second floor ng bahay namin. Okay, uh, please promote naman. Baka may mga upcoming events ka. And of ah, course, yes. your social media pages dun sa mga taong na-inspire mo with that story. Um, ayun, promote ko lang po yung halos. Is out na po sa lahat ng digital platforms ayan po sa Spotify and YouTube and also shout out lang po sa United Production ayan salamat po uh, kinuha niyo po ang coach and also sa Friends and Music po thank you so much maraming maraming salamat din sa iyo and I hope that you continue on inspiring more people John Jacob Plaza once again mga kasambahay more of the exciting ball game when we come back dito lang yan sa UNTV Cup Pabalik po tayo dito sa Nova Jesse. First game natin. Uh, para sa araw na to, but the last game and last day of the quarterfinals. BNP lamang po ng 49-39 kontra sa OP-PMS. Magandang hapon mga kasabahay. Eric Tipan kasama si Coach Ronnie Magsano. Almost a turnover para kay Sakano. Villanueva, catch and shoot. Wala. Kamorik, minsan yung excitement ng mga players at teams nananaig kaysa sa dapat gawin. Oo. At uh, may tinatawag yung mga coaches at uh, yung mga veterano. If you get up, if you get caught up in the moment, nakakalimutan mo yung mga mas mahala yung respeto. Nakilakailangan mong gawin. Excitement can kill. Excitement will help. But it can also be a uh, disadvantage if you don't know how to use and harness yung adrenaline rush uh -oh. that will propel you normally to play at a pace to your advantage. And right now, Coach Ronnie, as uh, Aljard knocks in two free throws, kanino, uh, nung first half, yung pace na yun, pabor sa PNP, ano? Pabor sa PNP kasi pace na may direksyon. Pace na nagpapasahan. Pace na nagahalap ng libreng kasama. At pace na nakakapasok sa loob. Yung OPPMS, yung pace nila, naging makasarili. And eventually, it caught up with them. They lost their biggest lead was 2-6. The and they only accounted for 13 second quarter points. Uh -oh. Kasi nga, madis madaling bantayan dahil hindi ka pumapasa eh. Nakaabang yung bantay. Mabantayan ka. Bago pumasa, eh, mamamatay na yung shot clock. Uh, let's see adjustments nga going to OBPMS here in the second half. Umikot, all and umiping, nothing but net. Ang ganda ng tira. Definitely, pagkapag, uh, pagka-veterano ang sinukat mo rito, veterano ang PNP sa laban dito sa UNTV Cup. And uh, normally, that really counts, especially in this type of a contest. Your experience, yes. Sonia, no, in crunch time, 
must win situation at yun nga situation ngayon ng PNP must win today dahil pag natalo sila dito naglag sila sa quarter finals but a win hindi pa po garantisadong mapasok sila ng semis they need to win by 7 points and they're up by 10 right now meaning they're taking care of business oh, oh. working towards their goal dalatin umikot uh, pipituhan ng foul si Serrano isipin mo buong first quarter kontrolado ng OPPMS Pero sa second quarter na natapos sa 22-11. Ano, no? 40. Double check natin ating talaan, ha? 47-37. Malaking positibong senyalis siya para sa PNP. They know the direction that they have to take, but more than that, they are doing the right things collectively, which is so important. Pansin ko kanina, before the... Uh third quarter, nag-uusap-usap si Dalaten, si Aljard, Paundo, and even Amalos. Let's see kung ano na pag-usapan. And will it translate, will translate to better teamwork here in the third quarter? I think they're applying a box and one defense. Apat nakasona, isa, nakastay home kaya lang ang meeting. You just cannot do or overdo yourself. Dahil lima lang kayo naglalaro eh. Uh, Estabilio, bullies his way inside! That's a word to describe that last sequence. Right into the basket, attacking the defense, that's always good. And then, this, this, nice this. Nice pass. It's an opening. Serrano continues to play really well. 20 points for Serrano to lead all scholars. He has missed only once from the field in this entire match. Estabilio with the advantage. Si Tolentino naman, makanyang pinostihan. To get the basket. In a raro paloop. <laughs> Mas under control dito ang OPPMS. The cut. The BP. Off the glass. Wala. Entry pass to the post and a weak side cut by Olin Amipi. It's the stay home defense of Aljar. These are things that you adjust on the fly. And sometimes players can grasp it and execute it. Pero sa experience ko kasama ng Eric, pag hindi mo na ituro sa insayo, magagawa mo na isa dalawa. Oo. Tapos bibitaw sila kasi hindi sanay. Consistency ang kailangan ko sa kanya. Mahirap talaga mag-coach, mahirap magturo. At para sa akin mas madali maglaro, maglaro na lang. Nicolas in the game, magpapahinga si Abaya. So both teams maliit na line up to. As Paudo misses, tumatakbo si Nicolás and yung uh, maliit na size kayo ng PNP. Meron silang speed to get the basket. It is back to the biggest lead na uh, responders naman sila ng Onse, 57-46. Full court press na naman, Coach Ronnie. Man to man para sa PNP. Ito lang ang ginagamit ng OPPMS. Parang ang ginamit ng PNP dito ay 13 na. 12. Malaten steps into a two. Yes. Malaten trying to stabilize the unit. Malaten now with a total of nine points. Sa tong matasa ng scoring ng PNP. The cut. Serrano, that is a travel. That's a good roadblock by Stabilio. Bumping and uh, diffusing the downhill move coming from Serrano. Defense has to be ang premium ng OPPMS. Aljard. Siyam na lang po ang kalamangan ng PNP. Oh, pinapapa ni Aljard with a long two. Four point run. Mahaya for 11, it's down to seven. Control, aggression, always essential. Mas kalmado rin ang opensa ngayon ng OPPMS. Good for him, you know? Villanueva, nakawala. Galing. Baseline. Yes! One of the best breakdown players together with Sarana. Aljard on the break. Last touch, Aljard. He's asking for a foul, pero walang itinawag. It was almost a home run play. But para sa PNP, Nicolas serving as the last line defense. Also having six points off the bench. Has played well throughout this match. Yan na naman si Nicolás. 9 point lead para sa PNP. 11 on the shot clock. Nicolás nakawala off the glass. Pakasok oh, yun. 
The Latin gamble, the Latin lost. Back to an 11 point lead and four straight points. Al charge, Pinayugan, Supalpal, but there's gonna be a foul on Ola the Leaping. Who uh, is limping. A para calf problem by Leaping. Throughout the season, he's had that uh, nagging pain. And now he asks to be taken off the playing court. Not a good sign. Kailan natin kung paano nangyari ulit. Free throws para kay Aljar. As we try and check ano nangyari kay Umiping. He's getting attention uh, on the sideline. And I'm sure Reina will get a report later on. Ito. Ayan, pinambuelo niya yung left leg niya. Ayan, pagbabsak. Back to a nine-point lead para sa BNP. Villanueva. Cross-court pass. Kapahong, pinalik sa gitna. Nine on the shot clock para sa BNP. Villanueva. The center keeping it alive. Yes. Good hustle para sa BNP. They have a fresh 14-second shot clock. Kabahu spots up. Off the glass. Three and a foul. Gonna believe it. Experienced players know how to play. In crucial matches. Earlier he was fouled by Dalatan. Taking a three. Now Kabahu gets a chance to complete a four-point play. This time fouled by Aljard. Building a 12-point lead. As OPPMS compounding the rows. After a... Stable start here in the third. Oh, oh. Pinakamalaking kalamangan na to. Not... Kanina, Rick, lima na lang to eh. 51-46. Oh. Ay, baba. Pero hindi na ipasok yung bonus. Aljar, 51-56 pala, Rick. Oh! That's a foul and basket counts. Yes. Yung call na yun. Could have gone either way. Para naka-establish siya si Nicolas dito. Let's see. Standing straight. Well, gumagalaw pa na konti yung paa. Tingin ko kung nagpabagsak siya ng bahagya. Offensive foul. Right now, Aljard working hard. 13 points for Aljard. Working, working harder here in the third quarter. But again, I'll reiterate this. They have to be better defensively. Because PNP has already 64 points. And PSP's, PNP's shooting rate. Compared to OPPMS, which is at 58%, is at 55%. Shadong mataas. Kabahog. Nakawala. The pass. Bayabaw. Nicolas goes down. Ball is last touch. Ang itatawa kontra sa OPPMS. Constitution. Serrano babalik kasama si Tolentino for BNP. Six on the shot clock para sa BNP. 10-point lead for the responders. Bayabao, dangerous pass. Four seconds to shoot. Two seconds. Bayabao puts it up in time. Yes! Woo! Slowly but surely, PNP taking control of this match. Grabe yung individual defense. Thank you. Oh, oh. My bit. Back to a 12-point lead for the PNP. Serrano, nice defense. Kay Estabilla, Estabilla spins, nowhere to go. Puts it up, in and out. Amaros, nawala ang bola. Desena diving. And that is last touch by Serrano. Physical play on Shrani. Effort plays, Ricky. Effort plays. Players are diving, slapping hands, slapping arms. Baseline drive, Algarve. Blocking foul. Tremendous scorer. Wow. Right, left, or downhill straight. Jab right, go left. Last line defender in front. Look at the way he twists his body to attack the left side. And that's because for an offensive foul. Ang galing talaga nito. That's why I said earlier he has to get his touches. Ang tagal hindi humawak ng bola. Oh. 
na malilibre din naman yung mga kasama niya dahil siya yung babantayan. So, single digits na ang kalabangan ng PNP. Nine points. Courtesy of Aljard's efforts. 16 points para kay Aljard. Nicolas. Loose ball. Nasa kamay ni Faundo. Papasa. Almost taken away by Tolentino. It stays with Estabillo and OBBFS. PNP scored 25 points in the first quarter. PNP scored 24 points in the second period. Now charge na kawala. This time, double team. Ito na Rick. Baka may report na Serena tungkol kay Ola Mamiping. Shawnee, update muna tayo dito kay Ola. Nang nipang niya kaupo ngayon sa bench ng uh, PNP responders. No, natuhod niya yung kanyang left cuff muscle kaya nagpapahinga muna siya. But he's coming back into action right now. The UNTV News and Rescue Team is icing and stretching that area no, para at least mawala yung pain. Also on the right leg, kung mapapansin nyo, meron siyang uh, strap doon sa kanyang right leg. No? Nagkaroon din pala siya ng kanyang uh, right cuff uh, muscle tear naman doon sa kanyang uh, right leg. But definitely with the strong will of Ola Nomiping, he will be back in action. Go, Trani. Maraming salamat, Rina. Very impressive willpower para kay Ola Nomiping as Aljard once again. Willpower, Ola Nomiping. Sheer will para naman kay Aljard. Zigzag, Kamikase, Banzai. Aljard now with a total of 18 points. 60% from the field exploding here in the third. 13 points only for his team in the previous quarter. But right now, with the quarter that started at 49-39, 20 points already para sa OPPMS. Majority of them. Four. Myers, the number one scorer in the season in our job. Si Serrano naman, hindi natin pwedeng uh, hindi banggatin. Si Serrano had eight first quarter points. Serrano had 8 second quarter points 16 points total Now with 6 third quarter points For a total of 22 Outstanding game played By Serrano together with Villanueva And then Cabal Cannot be overlooked 9 points and a perfect shooting game for Cabal From the 1 point or From the 2 point area From the 3 point line And even from the free throw Samantala, unti-unting tinatapyas ni Aljard single-handedly itong kalabangan ng PNP from a high of 12. Eh, pito na lang to Hinahabol nila. But they have to make stops. Ayun lang. Kasi kanina pa sila nakikipagpap- nakikipagpalita dito ng butos. Villanueva fakes. Villanueva so shifty, so fast. Oh, wow! Several twists. Pero airball yun. Let's tabilyo, bababa. Again, bullying its way inside. Rebound, Carvajal. Carvajal throws it away. And Aljard has to touch that basketball while he is sizzling hot. Mahanapin mo lang naman. It's a foul against Estabillo. Poor play, Estabillo. Two free throws coming up. PNP, they need to put some points on the board. Eh, kanina pa sila napipigilan ng depensa ng OBPMS. But Tolentino misses from the free throw line. Both teams are, uh, are at 60% at the line. Ganda ng preparasyon ng PNP. Ball pressure to wear down a short rotation. Aljard stop and pop way off. Carvajal with the offensive rebound. Aljard got in. Aljard gets it. Aljard double team. Aljard nowhere to go. Traveling. Double team already not willing to move that ball to the opposite side. The Sons and Toy turn over. Isa lang natutunan ko dyan. Mapa 3x3 o 5x5. Mayroon pa nalo mag-isa. Hanap ng uh, papasahan. Tolentino is blocked by Carvajal. Carvajal is running. Eight-point lead. Aljard cutting. Great defense mula sa likod para kay Aliban. Uh, Fourth place. Pimpi needs to win by six. 
Oh, plus six or more points. Six or more. Six or more. It has to be seven. At least. So, nineteen then L. Jardin. Oh, oh. Yeah, matalo, kung matalo, pero hindi pwede yung lumampas ng... Lampas ng pito. Ng pito. Galatin. Is foul? Penalty na po, parehong komponent. So, free throws all the way. Dalaten with nine points. He is 50% from the free throw line. Three of six. Pito. Ang hinahabol ng OBPMS. One more free throw para kay Dalaten. In and out. Again, splitting yung free throws, Chris Dalaten. Under two minutes, nalalabi sa ating third quarter. Nicolas, great move. Beautiful tap, Aniban. There's gonna be a foul again. This time para sa OBPMS, free throws para kay Aniban. And a warning. One out jar. Parang uh, flop warning. So Aniban off the bench with a great block kanina kay Aljar. Hindi na tawag mga coach on in an effort play. So Bahal only has two points. Abalos who had 10 first quarter points has been uh, contained to only 13. Zero for two para kay Aniban. Aljar tatakbo. One against three. Aljar with a hook shot short. Kay Bahal the rebound and the putback. Real Bahal has to work doubly hard late here in the third and in the fourth quarter if they are to survive this feisty unit of the responders. Villanueva, a uh, screen by Nicolas. Oh, great move by Villanueva. Aljar will be called for his fourth. Yun ang masakit. OBPMS. I think that will be on Carbajal. We will also have his fourth personal foul call against him. So Aljard stays with three personal fouls. Carbajal with four. So Abalos papasok to replace Carbajal. Natala Villanueva with 11 points. First. Second trip to the free throw line. Wala pa siyang naipapasok. Zero for two kanina. Dalawa pa ito, Rick. Dalawa pa ibibigay. May violation. So, yung breaks ng game, going the way of PNP. Anim kalamangan, one more free throw coming. Making a seven-point lead ulit para sa PNP. 71-64. Payabaw, back in, magpapahinga si Villanueva. Payabaw, a pesky defender para dito sa PNP. Pabantayan ngayon si Dalaten. Estabillo. This is a clear out. Dalaten one on one against Bayabao. Nice pass to Abalos. A holding foul. Good break. Para sa red shirts. Kaya dito siya ngayon call against Abalos. Guzman tatawaga ng foul. Abalos with 13 points already. 50 percent at the line. Ginto two for four. Ayaw, ayaw niya nung diretsyo na sa ring coach. So, ano, gusto niya talaga yung pa-boarding. Pa Huwag tayong makilang dalawa. <laughs> Kung baga sa binyo, ako na, doblete. Ako na hihirapan. Oh, tila mo, tila mo, tila mo. <laughs> Ala, sumahala, tuloy. Zero for two, that trip para kay Abalos. Payabaw, going all the way. Nice pass. The fake. Everything but the basket para kay Guzman. Dalate, naghahanap ng butas. In semi-transition, may foul si Guzman. And again, what ail of OPPMS is happening here again late in the third. Yung hindi mapitawan ng bola para makapasa. 
Pitong kalamangan ng PNP. And the Latin at the line. Under a minute, nalalabit sa ating third quarter. Driving for the Latin, for players in double figures, but will this be enough? Lay down to six para sa PNP. The Latin 50% at the line. But this time, two for two. That will be five of nine overall for the Latin. Lima ang kalamangan ng PNP. Bayaba with a spin. Bayaba na sundutan. Paundo. Three on one break. Estabillo all the way. Yes. From a high of uh, 64-52, a 12-point lead. This has been a 16-7 counter run para sa OPPMS. Another steal. Almost. Misola gets it. Got tied up. Kasama kay Ramos. Uh, possession arrow. Bibigay ang bola sa OPPMS. Good third quarter closure para sa OPPMS. And a bad last two plays para sa PNP. Dalawang back-to-back na turnovers yun. At yung kanilang dose na kalabangan nga. 64-52. Oo, sabi ni Coach Ronnie kanina. Ito ngayon, tatlo na lang. Naku po. Andrew Guzman once again giving up a foul. Three fouls in less than two minutes for the Guzman. Stops the clock. Allows the other team to inch closer. Bad news para dito sa PNP. They need to win by seven or more. And kanina, komportable sila ahead by double digits ngayon. Paubos na paubos to. It could be a one-point game before the quarter ends. Al Jard with 22. Almost single-handedly powered this team back here in the third. 88% at the line. Ayaw nang ipigay sa akin, ha? Akin na yan. <laughs> Isa na lang ang kalamangan ng PNP. Malaking bagay, wala sa wala ng meeting rin. Uh-huh. Tolentino starts up. Wala. Battle for the loose ball. Mapupunta sa OBPMS ang bola. Last pass by Guzman. Now a chance to take the lead para sa OBPMS with 11 seconds na lalabay sa third quarter. Estabillo between the legs. Estabillo drives. Illegal oh, pick. Play, play by the Latin. Kasi kayang ibig Estabillo yung bantay niya. Oh. Lakas na Estabillo. Lakas ng upper body ni Estabillo. Saka hindi naman humingi ng screen. Pag hindi humingi, huwag bigyan. Huwag kang pumunta. <laughs> Kasi matatakpan mo yung lulu sa tan. Oh. Natawagin ka naman pag kailangan. Kailangan. 4.8 seconds remaining. Last shot time. Tolentino passes. Misola with a catch. Oh, nice play, but no basket. There was some contact, pero walang ipilito. It's a one-point lead para sa PNP. Yes. Contra sa OBPMS. Oh, yes, OBPMS exploding with a 31 point third quarter. Wow. PNP has scored over 20 points per quarter. Pero pababa, 25, 24, 22. Huwag ba ang depensa, lumailay ng bahagya. Kalamangan na natin sa isa patungo sa huling sampung minuto. Welcome back sa Nova Desi para sa ating first quarterfinal game sa last day ng quarterfinals of the UNTV Cup Season 9. Magandang uh, hapon mga kasambahay. Ang uh, PNP responders holding on to a one-point lead going into the fourth quarter. All on a meeting. Ika-ika sa sidelines, Coach Ronnie. Sinusukat niya kung kaya eh. 
But no doubt they need him inside. Oh, yes. The biggest lead was 12 para sa PNP. What a spin! Nicolas loses on guard. Playing the game of his life. He scores a three-point lead. Grabe, no? Mano-mano na ito, eh? Oh. Nicolás almost with the steal. OBBMS led by as many as six points in the first quarter. Biggest lead. Oh. Pero dumuho sa yung PNP. PNP, second quarter, dumuho sa yan. 54-52. Oh. Sa third quarter, oh. third. Oh. Third quarter, that's right. Tight defense, double team si Paudo. He gives it up. Estabillo, ito, hihingi ng pick ngayon. Pupukol, napakalayo. Air ball para kay Estabillo. That's good defense para sa PNP. Nail biter. Yeah. Epic match in our final play there for the quarter finals. 73-70. PNP needs seven more points to get a seven-point lead. Or make that three more, four more points. Ito si Paundo, tatakbo. Oh, nice play, Paundo. In traffic. Early for quarter timeout after the turnover. Leading to the fast break opportunity coming from Paundo. Paundo now has a total of 15 points. Lead down to one, PNP. Lahat na nasa loob ah. Wala na tayong bukas. Patay kung patay, di ba? Lagi natin sinasabi yun, di ba? Tayo na kung magwintis ka dyan, mamamatay ka ba, Nog? Hindi naman, di ba? Itira mo! Nagwintis, kunin mo ulit! Ibabalik ko! Ganun lang yun. Hindi tayo bababa dito nang hindi natin sinusot yung bola. Ganun lang. Back to a one-point game, 73-72. Uh, PNP holding on to a one-point lead dito sa fourth quarter. They need to win by seven. Serrano spats up. In and out. Al Jard with the big rebound. Al Jard against Desena. Spots up. The go ahead pass to Senna to attack Mo. The big man lays it in. Wala ka ng tiwala na bilang neba kay Desena. Giant steps for Desena. Saka si Pag, Desena. The biggest man on the floor and the quickest man on the floor. Galate, nice pass. Abalos, too deep sa ilalim. Stand up for Max Pedro. Valentino, three on two break. Serrano, the pass. Bounces off the leg ni Paundo. Abalos, to attack Mo. Nicolas defending. Is it counted? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. Rapid, nakatayo yung mga nasa OPP. Nakatayo. Nasa responders. Basket will not count. Sideline inbound para sa OPP MS. Yes, if Kabao will be able to weave his magic, the veteran magic, para dito sa, oath, sa PNP. Almost a steal para kay Nicolas. Nine seconds to shoot para sa OBPMS. Make it six seconds. Five. Paundo, nakawala. A oh, big rebound sa ilalim. The Latin. Uh, ball is still loose. And Paundo, si Desena, possession arrow. Will give possession to OPPMS. Then the long lab. Yeah. Makbakan talaga sa parehong kapunan na looking to stay alive dito sa quarterfinals. Ooh, dangerous pass. It goes outside. Turnover OPPMS. PNP. They need four more points to make it a seven-point lead. That's the requirement para makalusot sila uh, going to the semifinals. Nicolás has been great off the bench. Pati si Kabaho. The pick by Desena, Kabaho for three. Oh, 
Dalate, ni bababa ang bola. Dalate, crossing over. Kicks it out. Estabillo. Tapik palabas. Bola nga mabunta kay Faudo. Nice pass. Abalos underneath. Dalate is open. In and out. Nicolas all alone. Nicolas lays it in. A timeout dito para sa OBBMS. The lead is five. Para sa BNB after this fast break. Finished by Nicolas with the layup. Depensa. Alam niyo yung nangyari ganina. Because of that, of I miss. Nakamaba ka agad sila. Dapat meron tayong ganun na nag-anticipate ng maglalag. Offensively, bigay natin kay Jaco kung sino man ang bantay niya, si Kabahogman o si Tolentino kaya. Huwag lang defensive foul, Jaco ha. Tapos, tapos, pare. Nag-double team, Jaco, look for the answer. PNP going all out 100% dito uh, trying to put back up a 7 point lead at least and right now their lead is 5 pero OBPMS also fighting tooth and nail dito Aljard and Dalatin, Paundo Abalos, Estabillo yung 5 on the floor para sa OBPMS meantime it's Tolentino, Kapahu Nicolas De Sena and Villanueva para sa responders. Paundo for three. Wala. Tumatakbo Villanueva. Villanueva with the pass and the basket. Back to back pass break points para sa PNP. And here it is. Their lead is back to seven. 79-72. Now they must defend. Estabillo crossover. Estabillo. Oh wow. yes. Take a look at this move. Tignan ko nga yung galaw. At tignan ko yung push-up after. Mahira. One against three, no problem. And then. And then, and then, and then. Sayang. Three defenders. Piliwasa ni Estabillo. But he misses the free throw. Although it goes to Talatin. So, an extra possession para sa OBPMS. They can make it a four-point play. Estabilio ulit. Oh, yes! No! In and out! There's gonna be a foul. Estabilio. First team foul para sa OBPMS. Serrano papasok to replace Nicolas who has again played so well. No sign of omipping yet. He's still rubbing yung kanyang uh, calf. Uh, under six minutes na lalabi. Will he play? Uh, we will find out. Kapahu gets away. Nice pass. Serrano with the fake. Traveling. Big defensive stop. Para dito sa OPPMS. Yet, they're still behind by four. Nearing the halfway mark. Ng ating oh. quarter. Paundo faking. Estabillo asking for it. Estabillo driving left. That's his favorite move. Abalos, big rebound. Ando si Dicena. So, inilabas sila ang bola. Si Ajar, di na naman nakakawak ng bola rin. Abalos, paposte against the bigger Dicena. Abalos. Oh, yeah. nice move. Left first, bas- right. first basket in the final quarter. Serrano hits the side of the backboard. Seven point lead. Tapno na lang para sa responders. Aljard goes down. Masela wanted to make sure na hindi maka one two step. Aljard is really hurt. Let's take a look. Saan siya tumama? I don't know if sa chin or sa shoulder tumama yung ulo ni Aljard. Uh, he seems to be okay. There is no cut. 
Officials are reviewing the play. Seventy nine, seventy six, BNB. Estabillo. Getting some tips from the coaching staff. BNP, they need to win by seven. So just a normal foul on Desena. It's going to be a baseline inbound for us, uh, OBBMS. Serrano will sit down. Nicolas will come back in. Nicolas with 12 points already. He's just a top player in double digits for the PNP. But all the meeting is still not around. Oh. Estabillo, blast the bus. Ball last touch for the Desena. Coming extra possessions for the OBPMS, but they have not been able to convert. Ang kagandahan, dua basa tatlo yung kanilang hinahabi. Oh. Ada tata pes nila na tata pes yung oras. Abalos, double team. Abalos, block. Abalos gets it back. Oh, wow. Power. Villanueva faking. Triple team. One point game. Villanueva steps outside. That would have counted. Saya. That hurts. But what about Abalos? Yeah. Grabe. Sabi, di ba? Sabi ko sa'yo, back-to-back co-best players of the game. Turning back the hands of time. And the evergreen pioneer getting the job done here para sa OPPMS. OPPMS can take the lead with this possession. Dalaten, nakawala. Dalaten, hang time! Yes! OPPMS, number 80-79. Timeout, PNP responders. 8-2 run in the last two and 43. Down by five. They call timeout. Now they're up by one, heading to the last four minutes and 17. Le, ano lang yung cycle lang yun? Four minutes, four minutes. Pwede mong palitan nyo, wala ba kayo sub na referee? Hindi, hindi po pwede. Bawal, bawal. Pero alam, bawal. Sobrang sama nung, sobrang sama, wala yun. Hindi ako magbibigay. After trailing by as many as 12 points, OPPMS lamang na po ng isa, 80-79. Delikado ang posisyon ngayon ng PNP. They need to win and they need to win by 7 points or more. And there was uh, a little controversy kanina tungkol dun sa itinawa kay Villanueva na stepping when he pulled up para sa isang tres. And now that I think there's a technical foul that will be called contra sa PNP. Technical foul on the PNP responders ahead coach Good. for a sportsman like Bader. Technical leader for John Azar. Now Al Jart can make it a two-point lead para sa OPPMS. One of the best teams in terms of fighting back after a deficit. Itong OPPMS. Yes. That's why they're still alive. Anim lang ako sa naglalaro dito rin. Oo. Anim lang. Ang ng rotation. Oh. Itong OPPMS. Pero lahat ang naglalaro. Matibay. They were able to recover. Down 64-52, remember? Villanueva took a shot. And 
not sure if it was a three-point attempt. That's a three. Three. So three free throws para kay Villanueva. They need to put the points and put it up ng mabilis uh, kasi four minutes na lang po nalalabi sa ating fourth quarter and they are now down by one actually down by two they're down by two I believe oo kasi yung bonus yung technical free throw ni Aljard naging dalawa ang kalamangan nun eh There's the official score, 81-79. But three free throws para kay Villanueva. If may pasok na lahat, they will take the lead, pero isa lang. And, oh! The pressure is on. The pressure is on. Villanueva is 33% at the line. He is 3 for 8. Wala nang dribble. Gets it! We're tied at 81. Pero hindi ito ang kailangan ng, ng PNP. They need to win by 7. And they only have under 4 minutes para makagawa ng 7 points and stop OPPMS. Every possession, napakalaking task Talate, nakawala. Nice pass! Abalos, easy basket! Without Carbajal, Abalos has stepped up to the plate. But more than that, Talate, the willing passer. There's an illegal pick. Paundo and Cabahog nagkakainitan. PNP has to be composed. We have to remember what lies ahead. No other choice but to win, and win by seven, at least. And that turnover is not going to help. Kasi, offensive foul, hindi ka nakatira. Coach Ronnie, 3 and 30. Nalalabi. And PNP down by 2. There's going to be a foul. Bayaba with a foul. That's costly. PNP and team penalty. So Estabillo, two free throws. Bayabao cannot believe it. He was trying to play good defense, pero tinawagan siya ng foul. And those are the we started the quarter, I believe. Hindi ako nagkakamali. 71-70. 31 points para sa OPPMS. They were still behind by one. We open up the fourth. Still behind 77-72. Seven-minute mark. 11-4 run. In the last four minutes for the Red Shirts. Anchored on Abalos, Dalatin. And of course, itong si Aljar. No Olan Omiping the rest of the way para sa PNP. There's going to be a foul on Aljard. So it's going to be on Serrano, Villanueva, Tolentino, Nicolas, and Palabao. Na habulin tong two-point deficit at makapuntos pa ng pito. Otherwise, hindi po sila tutulak papunta sa semifinals. Malalaglag sila today. Villanueva, three. Yes! Oh, big shot! Just like that, they're up by one. Abalos. Oh, could have been a foul. Hindi <laughs> tinawag. Nag-uubos ng oras sa OBTMS dito. They have six on the shot clock. The Latin spots up. Oh! Woo! Foul shooting a three. Nicolas. And the coaching staff upset at Nicolas for even touching the Latin with the challenge. Ito yung coaching staff where they're talking amongst themselves. 
obviously upset at uh, the foul committed by Nicolas. The play is going to get reviewed. That's why we're taking time here. Officials are checking it, and I think it's th they say it's the correct call. Uh, yep, there is a foul on uh, Nicolas. Uh, three free throws para kay Talate. Masakit to. Because para kay Talate, uh, he is 60% at the line. He's shot 6 for 10. So may pasok niya a few here. May pasok pa ng PNP. Pero fortunately for the responders, the first is a miss. Two thirty-nine remaining. Sa ating fourth quarter, Galatan gets the second. Eighty-four all. PNP needs to win by seven, and they could be down by one. Pagkatapos ng free throw na to. Nope, we're tied at eighty-four. May konti pang pag-asa para sa PNP. Tolentino drives, stops short on the shot. The Latin gets away. Alchard. The Latin jab stepping contra kay Villanueva. The Latin, oh, nice move. Everything but the basket. Payabao, oh, the pass taken away. The Latin, great defense. Alchard, sasaksak, Alchard short. Alchard picks it up. Tapit para box. It will stay with OPPMS. Under two minutes remaining in the game. You can just imagine what's going through the mind of all in the meeting right now, Kasama Eric. Paundo. This time, OBPMS getting the breaks of the game. Paundo's shot made contact with the ring. Naka offensive rebound pa ang OBPMS. Uh, but Estabillo missed it. It went out of bounds. Ngayon, bola ng PNP. Pero, with 1.44, nalalabay na oras, Coach Ronnie. Ano pang pag-asa dito ni uh, Tolentino and PNP? Honestly, puntos, oh. honestly, may overtime. Wow. Tapos, may chance ako ulit. Para sa extra five minutes. Nang pito. Nalaman so, yun na lang habol mo. Yes, yes, yes. You do, so, you don't want to win by one point, two yes. points. Yes. Huwag ka nalang pumuntos para maka-oti ka. Hindi ka rin pwedeng hindi pumuntos. Kailangan makastop ka. Basta huwag kang... Hindi, hindi sila pwedeng lumamang na isa. Correct. <laughs> but you have to make the stops now. Wow. Okay, after the official review, wala nga talaga na PNP. The officials are making sure every call is correct. Kasi, elimination game po ito. Matalo ang PNP, tanggal sila. Even if they win by 6, tanggal sila. They need to win by 7 to move forward. Walang kabigat, eh? Villanueva, inside out dribble, Villanueva, oh, what a shot, ah, man, up two, and the power of the three-point shot will be tested late in this match. Yep. For OPPMS coach Ronnie, as long as hindi sila down by seven, will they want to lose the lang? Because they will... Wala sa isip nilang matalo, nakikita mo eh. Oo. The Latin. Against Nicolas, the Latin gets away off the glass. Voila! Nicolas, the go ahead. The center side, Lalen! Oh! Oh my! And Tolentino wants the uh, last play reviewed. Pero hindi na yata rin reviewin yun. That is outside. Timeout dito, Obey PMS. They're down by two, 86-84, with one minute exactly, nalalabi. I think we can hang on here if it's okay with the rec, dahil mabilis lang itong timeout na to, at more than that, yung tension in the air, kailangan uh -huh. maramdaman mo. Could have been a four-point lead para sa kanila, and a three-point shot. They'll push it to a seven-point win kung sakali. Instead, the score said 86-84. Lamang-lamang ng dalawang PNP, pero bola na. OPPMS. Pagkakuha ng bola, kung kanino man mapasa sa inyo, takbo na natin. Takbo na natin. Pare, hindi natin hinahanap yung first available shot. 
yung pinakamagandang tira. 24 seconds ang kinuha natin eh. Ha? 24 seconds. Pag naliliwan, okay. Pag wala, set natin. Tawag tayong dos. Tawag tayong dos. Tawag tayong dos, ha? Dali, dali. Tawag tayong dos. Same side, Enteng Aljard. Enteng Aljard, same side. Paglabas, paglabas ni Aljard, may iwan si Enteng. Pwede kay Enteng, pwede kay Aljard. Okay? One, two, three, one. Pensa po na. So, dalawang options doon. Coach Ron, isa play na yun. Aljard or Estabilio. Down by two, ang OPPMS, 60 seconds exactly remaining in this match. Here we go. Abusing nila yung oras. Alchard spots up. Wala. Rebound para kay Serrano. They don't have time to dilly-dally. Kailangan nila makapunta sa lag. Alam ng PNP eh, no? Lambaw, hindi. Uy! Oh! That's oh a problem! Goodness. Oh my! Critical mistake coming from Tolentino. That preserves a two-point lead from OPPMS with under with half a minute remaining. What was that shot for? Oh, a steal! They let it go! They let the shot go so the game can be tied. 86 all. With 19 seconds remaining, PNP can hold on to the ball here if they are not fouled and send it to overtime. With 19 seconds, Coach Ronnie, 86 all. PNP ang may hawak ng bola. Will OPPMS foul? <laughs> They're not in penalty. But again, the question, if they know the situation, and the ball was with the Latin, why take the shot? Because the Sena, miraculously, parang nawala sa kanya yung bola. And then, OPPMS got the basket to tie the game. Well, eto, final 19 seconds. Tolentino looking at the clock. And Desena, they will try to hold on to it. OPPMS trying to foul, but kailangan pa ng two, two more fouls. PNP knows the situation. Yeah. That's why the Latin should not have taken that shot in the game. Yep. Can they throw backcourt, Coach Rodney, from here? Yes. That's the question. Will they throw backcourt para makaubos ng oras? Uh, OBP, I'm ask, asking for a timeout. They get it. Seven seconds remaining. If you're fouled here, you have to throw the ball in here. Pero bola ng PNP Rick eh. Oo. Uh, labas ka, labas ka, labas ka. Labas ka, labas ka. Uh, attorney! Oh, attorney, attorney! Pasok ka! At, uh, labas ka, labas ka, labas ka. Wala na kayong foul eh. Ikaw, meron ka bang foul? Isa pa. Ilan ang foul ni Enteng? Okay. Ang papaul, ikaw. At saka ikaw, Andrew. Oh. Okay. Coach, ano tayo kasi? Kasi nagtatanawang isip niya. We go win, di ba? Paul tayo, Paul tayo, Paul tayo. Ha? Paul tayo. Pagka-receive, kahit sino, paulin natin. Kasi dapat kong parang pinapaul na natin. Oh, Paul tayo, Paul tayo. Come on, come on. So malinaw, they will foul. And that next foul will send PNP to the line. Pero kailangan, they, they foul with some time remaining sa clock.
para makuha ulit nila yung bola. Because obviously, <laughs> PNP would miss it. May hirapan kang ipaliwanag. There's the foul. So Tolentino will try to miss both to send it to overtime. Kasi kailangan, para sa mga nanonood pala ngayon, kailangan ng PNP manalo by seven. So they can't afford to win by one or two points. Kaya kailangan mag-OT po tayo for them to have a chance na pumasok sa semifinal. So Tolentino will try to miss this. This is gonna be fun to see. Intentionally miss your free throws. There it is. And that's why the Latin should not have taken the shot earlier. Pero coach, with 5.7 seconds, may pag-asa pa makapuntos itong OBPMS. Yeah, sigurado. Tignan natin kung saan ang tagong gitong bola. Wala nang timeout parehong kapunan. So they will have to inbound from all the way down here. There's a miss. Oh, but Tolentino gets it back! Ang estabilo did not foul. They will let it go. We go to overtime, ladies and gentlemen. You plan it up. BNP coach Ronnie executed to perfection. Whatever it takes to get to the semis, and that's, that's wow. where we stand right now. Very exciting last two minutes of the fourth quarter. Na nagdala sa atin dito sa overtime. PNP, para sa mga kabubukas na ng TV sets, PNP po kailangan manalo by seven. So they had a chance to win it by one, two points. They didn't do it because they need the extra five minutes to try and win by seven. No Olan Umiping still. The first possession, Serrano dump pass. He gets it back. Serrano puts it in. 24 for Serrano continues to play well. And I thought the biggest play in the fourth was that lost possession by Misola. Uh -huh. Which the Latin, uh, umbaga, eh, bit the bait. Kung nabitawan, ano wala yung bola, pwede yung nawakan na niya. Pero at in the heat of the moment, you want to drive to the basket and score. Ayun yun ang nangyari kanina. Watch out for Serrano. Serrano behind the back. Serrano, everything but the basket. The Latin with the rebound. Aljard, tumatakbo. Aljard, taken away by Tolentino. Four on one break. Nice pass. Nicolás sa ilalim. Nasun to Dani Abalos. Serrano has it. 16 on the shot clock. Tolentino, baseline. The kick out pass, Villanueva. Travels. And close out by Stabilio. Second lease in life for the PNP. May oras pa sila. This is 4:08. Labang sila na dalawa. They need five more points to get a seven-point lead and protect it. Ubus oras naman dito. Oh, paundo. Estabilio. Wala. Estabilio has struggled from outside. Ball last touch by the Latin. This is what they should have done earlier. Sa huling minuto. Kill the time. Uh -oh. Again, walang olan umiping po para sa PNP. He played in the first three quarters, pero got hurt. And uh, will not see action anymore. Calf problem po para kay umiping. Tolentino. Yes! Big shot! Five point lead. That's not good news para sa OPPMS. Paundo sa sagot. Dalatin keeping it alive. Abalos driving. Abalos off the glass. Rebound. Tolentino.
Serrano. De Sena sa ilalim. De Sena reverse is good. Yes, seven. seven points. They got there in two minutes. They need to protect this lead. Estabillo passes. Abalos has it. PNP needs stops, many stops. Mula ngayon. That's gonna be an offensive foul. The pressure is on the side of OPPMS right now. PNP was able to do something that they were not able to do in the fourth quarter, which was lead by seven. Throw in all the numbers. Oh, throw away all the numbers, throw away what happened in the last four quarters. This is gut check time here in the extra time of this match. Drive inside. Alchard. Nas Dutan Saligon. It's going to be a foul on Villanueva. BNP, biggest lead, Dose, in the third quarter. Mantalang ang uh, OPPMS, uh, led by as many as six points in the first quarter. BNP, well, both teams in the penalty, as you saw Alan Obiping on the bench along with Kabaho, Bisola, and some of the others. Six point lead. Natapesa na ng isa. Second free throw, Alchard. Big rebound para kay Desena. Now they gotta work on putting up points again itong PNP. They need seven points or more na kalamangan. Villanueva drives left. Villanueva spots up. Rebound na pabunta kay Estabillo. Estabillo is off and running. Oh! Offensive foul. Kay Estabillo. They will review it. The off, the off arm, the Estabillo, uh, trying to push off against Tolentino. Mawakikita nyo dito yan. Tinamahan sa mundot, kaya humawi. Tolentino is still down. Yeah, Tolentino seems to be okay. And will get up on his own. So a turnover para sa OPPMS. Unsportsmanlike foul in the kay Estabillo. So it's free throws and possession para sa PNP. A big swing from like foul. Pabor For para sa PNP ngayon. On number 25, with John Maverick Estabillo. Estabillo shaking his head. And he fouls out as well. So big blow contra sa OPPMS coach Ronnie. I'm just waiting for the next play. Because this is a series of unfortunate events. Uh -huh. Para sa OPPMS. And they cannot look any other way. Except inside their team. Two straight free throws para kay Tolentino. Their lead is 8-9-1 here in extra time for PNP. And possession pa ng PNP. Nice pass. De Sena, everything but the basket. The back tip, Nicolas, may hawak ng bola. Steel. Still not willing to give up that pass. They did. Oh, Aljar gets away. Down to six. PNP again forced to get a basket here. A do or die basket. Tolentino for three. Oh, big shot. Antonio's having a shooting slump. Nearly the last six games for the PNP. It has exploded in the fourth, all the way here to extra time. 
No look pass. This side Layup and a foul. Believe it or not, this is a 12-3 overtime scoreline. Wow. And that started dahil this sa steal ni Tolentino on the other end. The Latin cannot believe it. Desena, bonus free throw, no good. A lane violation para kay Nicolás. Papunta ang bola sa OPPMS. Uh, right now, they're enjoying an 11-point lead. PNP kailangan ng stops dito. A, a dribbling violation contra kay Aljard. And this is implosion on the part of the OPPMS. They finally call a timeout. They are minus four right now in terms of the number of points that they can afford to lose. PNP looking good with 14 points here in extra time. After one stop, we run, we we go to the basket. Go, go, go. We go to the basket. Tapos stop lang tayo ulit. Stop, stop, stop. Babe, ang kailangan lang natin abulin is five. Go, dalawang balik pa yan. Dalawang, dalawang balik lang. Dalawang square lang to. Okay? Stop tayo. Stop, stop lang. Tapos derecho. Stop derecho. Pare, huwag mong ano yun yung... Huwag kang gumawa down dun sa three points. Lalo na ni Tolentino, ha? Pare, pag ako ng bola, atake tayo. Come on, come on, come on. 107 remaining sa overtime. Para sa OPPMS, they don't need 11 points. They only need to score at least 5 points para maibaba yung kalamangan ng PNP under 7 points. Kasi kahit matalo sila dito, if they lose under 7 points, tanggal po ang PNP sa quarterfinals. Oh, nice bounce pass. Beautiful play. Serrano with a reverse. Closer and closer to the semis. For the one-time UNTV Cup champion, will this be the end of the road? That is OPPMS. Oh! Another unsportsmanlike foul on Aljard. And Aljard, that's going to be four fouls. Sorry, five fouls na by Aljard, so he's out of the game. And that could be it para sa OBPMS with 49 seconds remaining. This is a 13-point lead para sa PNP. Para naman sa OBPMS, they, they're the ones who need to score at least seven points. In 49 seconds. In 49 seconds. Without Aljard. Without Estabilio. Para maibaba nila yung kalamangan to under 7. Wala na rin si Dalatin sa loob. And you go back again to that shot by Dalatin. Now a 14 point lead. Now, OBPMS must score 8 points in 49 seconds. And they need to get a stop muna dito. But OBPMS is not fouling, Eric. Uh -oh. Ito, they need quick baskets, sabi ng coaching staff. Fondo for 3. Ramos with the rebound. Oh, air ball. And that probably is it. Believe it or not, this is the end of the road for one of the most exciting teams in the UNT Cup. A team that was inside already in the semis in the last 18 seconds, Kasama uh Eric. -huh. But they opted to score. Instead of doing leather luck and killing the time. Fifteen seconds and counting. This is a miraculous win. 
Nothing less para sa PNP. Come from behind win and they needed to win by 7. And they will win by 14. Doble sa requirement, Coach Ronnie. They scored 17 in extra time. Gave up only 3 points. What a comeback by PNP. And a big heartbreak for APPMS. Hit. And that's the way it is in basketball. And it is official. BNP advanced to the semi. Saya na kita na po sa video screens. Uh, show of sportsmanship. Aron Amipig not available um, halfway to the fourth quarter and the entire overtime. But doesn't matter, Coach Johnny. Imagine no, surviving and winning by this much without Aron Amipig. Oh. A team that was already lost into oblivion is finding ways. And understanding what it takes to get to the semis. And again, it boils down to experience, no doubt. And that understanding, yun ang napakalaking bagay doon. Ito B lang eh. Oo. Pero dapat masalam ng B lang ng OPPMS. That's right. Our best players right now with Rina Camara. Rina, take it away. Here our best players of this ball game. We have Rolly Serrano and Richard Villanueva of the PNP Responders. Congratulations to you guys. Our final score is 103 to 89. Ito muna ha kay Rolly Serrano. Rolly, nung last game nyo against uh, the OPPMS, nalo dito ang kupunan ng OPPMS, and they were saying you were one of the prolific uh, scorers in that ball game. Pero paano ngayon nakabawi kayo against the OPPMS? Uh, nandun po kasi yung ano namin, yung willing namin manalo at makabawi sa OPPMS kasi nakaraan natambakan po kami. Third quarter, na-struggle kami. Pero ngayon, nag-aaral kami, inaaral namin lahat ng defense namin. Mga coaching staff, walang tigil, paalala. Mga senior ko po, hindi po nagsawa magpaalala. Tsaka yung jelling ng team, binuupo namin para po manalo ngayong game na to. Alright, maraming salamat, Rolly. Ito naman kitayo kay Richard Villanueva. Richard, you have a chance to go to the semifinals. Antayin lang natin yung ating second game dito. Just in case, makapasok kayo doon sa ating semifinals. Sino ba ang gusto niyong makalaban? Ang AFP o Judiciary at bakit? Uh, kahit sino siguro basta pag-aandaan lang namin uh, lahat naman ng game namin pinag-aandaan namin lalo na yung mga coaching staff namin yung coach namin so yun lang pag-aandaan lang namin What about your message to your fans and supporters? Pinabalik ko yung pabalik ko dyan sa Pampanga uh, tapos pinabalik ko rin si Marvin Manalo at saka si Gibson Sumat uh, tapos Marisol Boys uh, 7FC uh, RMB yun lang po Salamat, Richard. What about you, Rolly? Mga gusto mong batiin, pasalamatan sa larong ito. Uh, salamat po sa lahat na supporters ng PNP Responders. Saka binabati ko po yung pamilya ko, nanay ko, dalawang anak ko, tsaka po yung asawa ko, mga binang ko po. Uh, at yung mga tropa ko po, mga kaibigan ko sa bahay. Uh, at mga kasama ko po sa trabaho, saka sa Binondo Police, tsaka sa MPD. Maraming maraming salamat po sa support niyo. Thank you po. Maraming salamat din sa ating best players of this ball game. We have Rolly Serrano and of course Richard Villanueva of the PNP Responders. Up next, our last game dito sa ating quarterfinals round, ang NHA Home Masters contra sa GSIS Series. Wag po kayong alis.
back here at the game. So welcome to our game two this afternoon. It's the NHA Home Masters going up against the GSIS Series. We're still coming to you live here at the Novadesi Convention Center. And you can also catch us at our UNTV channel. At pwede rin po sa ating YouTube channel, UNTV News and Rescue, with now 3 million subscribers and counting. And for those of you who just tune in, ito po ang ating game recap on our first game kung saan nag-overtime po tayo dyan. At nanalo po dyan ang kupuna ng PNP responders kontra sa OPPMS with the scores 103 to 8. At habang nag e po at nag warm up po, itong dalawang kupunan sa aking likuran, silipin po muna natin ang ating top 5 plays from last week's game. Watch this. Sa pag-arangkada ng executive face-off at ng Season 9 Quarter Finals, balikan natin ang maiinit na hardcourt actions ng ating mga kumpunan nitong nakaraang linggo. Panoorin natin ang top 5 plays of the week. Ang ikalimang play, ang acrobatic layup ni Furious Guard Rene Boy Bansali. Ang number 4 naman, ang chase down block ni train racer center Paul Carbajal to deny the easy layout. Rank number 3, ang swabbing move ni train racer forward Chris Dalaten to shake his defender and make the open layout. Chip away from Dalaten. Dalaten trying to control it. Uses Ang pangalawang matinding play, ang magandang inbound play ng Maggie's from Ronald Martin to Romulo Paras in the paint. And then a drop pass to Ian Ramoso for an easy basket. Lobo kay Paras, pinalit ka agad, yes! At ang number one play of the week, ang matinding pasahan ng Furies from Mark Escalona to Aaron Sunga, and then to Robert Diaz for an and one play. Kayabahan pa natin ang mas exciting na aksyon mula sa natatanging liga ng public servants. UNTV Cup At po mga kasambahay ang ating top 5 plays from last week's game. At this point, good luck to both teams. Mas ating papasa ko na ulit kay Sir Eric Tipan and Coach Ronnie Magsano. Back to you guys. Maraming salamat, Rina Villamar, Camera, Eric Tipan, Coach Ronnie Magsano. Coach, second game, the last game as well ng ating quarterfinals today. At iba ang uh, storyline dito sa parehong kapunan. Simple lang ito, ang GSIS. Wala nang pag-asa tumulit sa semifinals. Ang LHA ay pasok na sa semifinals. Ang GSIS will only be playing, I believe, with about 6 to 8 players today. Para naman sa LHA, they are coming in with a full force as uh, they're about to... They're, they're wanting to stay sharp heading sa Final Four. Alright, kilala, uh, kilala natin ang lineup ng parehong kapunan in just a little bit. Ito po yung current standings natin after the overtime win kanina ng responders contra sa OBPMS. And a win here by NHA will uh, once again solidify their hold on the top spot heading into the semis. At uh, sila makakabangga ng number 2 seeded team. At yan ang team ng AFP. Dahil ang judiciary ang numero unong team papasok sa semis. OBPMS the heartbreak, heartbreaker of a loss and PNP waiting for the result of this match to make it to the semis. That's right. Now let's meet your Furies and Home Masters. Back here at the Nova Jesse Convention Center, as yes, we continue with the last of the quarterfinal round in Season 9 of the UNTV Cup Ang Liga ng Public Servants. Give it up first 
for your NHA Home Masters. Number zero, J.D. Dizon. Double zero, Mark Valdez. Number five, Joseph Forbes. Number seven, Waldemar Tibay. Number nine, Alvin Vetuk. Number 12, John Kenneth Clemente. Number 13, Rodolfo Sumaya. Number 15, Brian Dabu. Number 21, Jesus Prado. Number 22, Marvin Mercado. Number 23, Sherman Crisostomo. Number 35, Jose Adolfo. Number 45, Ralph Tibay. Number 56, Jojo Palad. In number 66, Antonio Lustestica. Their head coach is Bennett Palad. Assistant coach is Sir Eric Salamat. In Charles Kimpo. Now make some noise for your GSIS Furies. Number zero, Carlo Gonzalez. Number two, Tristan Hernandez. Number three, Michael Berad. Number five, Ma Maki Escalona. Number six, Rolly Laurel. Number seven, Rene Boy Banzali. Number 11, Dennis Bonyi. Number 12, Michael Enriquez. Number 18, Jonathan Pareño. Number 24, June Alfonso. Number 25, Aaron Martinez. Number 28, Aaron Sunga. Number 82, Romer Diaz. And number 97, Tomas Cementera. Their head coach is Roger Yap. Assistant coaches are Daniel Martinez, Rex Villanueva, and Eric Rodriguez. Let's have first call out the starters of your NHA Home Masters. At guard number 45, Ralph Nibai. The other guard number 12, John Kenneth Clemente. At center, double zero, Mark Valdez. At forward, number 15, Brian Dabu. In the other forward, number 5, Joseph Forbes. Check out now the starters of your GSIS Furies. At guard number 5, Maki Escalona. The other guard number 7, Rene Boy Bansali. At center, number 82, Romer Diaz. At forward, number 18, Jonathan Pareño. In the other forward, number 12, Michael Enriquez. Officiating this ball game are Hernan Alejo, Edgar Orfilia, and Lucio De La Torre. This is the UNTV Cup on Liga Nung Public Service. That was the uh, last quarterfinal game of the day. Pagita ng uh, NHA na already semifinals bound contra sa uh, GSIS na tanggal na po and uh, will play their final game of the season. Only eight players sa lineup na yun ng GSIS. Matalang ang uh, NHA with a full lineup here as Escalona will bring it down para sa Furies. Banzali, binabantayan ni Rafi by Escalona. Shoot save three and knocks it in. Let's go to this report by Rina. Yes, sir, Eric, a different story to tell para dito sa kupanan ng GSIS Furies who will exit this season feeling accomplished and full of pride. This is the first in the eight seasons they have joined here to reach the quarterfinals round. That alone is progress for the team. As per coach D. Martinez, he gives all praises to the boys who showed up today to play. Their never-say-die attitude and their unselfishness as players made them reach this far. Now, I also ask around the players, no, kung ano yung reaction nila for this season. Si Rene Boy Bansali ang sabi niya, okay na sana, feeling daw nila makakarating sila in the sense but a team loss, players, and some got injuries. Ito naman si Jonathan Pareño. He is happy with what they reach so far, and he's thankful for this opportunity. Maki Escalona, on the other hand, said, the biggest thing is to set a winning culture for the GSIS team and let the team soar higher in the future. At para naman dito kay Sir Jun Alfonso, he said, this is uh, the best in the eighth season he's been here. Sir Eric and Coach Ronnie, back here. Maraming salamat, Rina. Uh, just get better each and every year. Escalona, back-to-back -back three pointers, Coach Ronnie. Good start for the Furies. Only with eight players today, but uh, looking to fight out with the home masters and uh, hopefully come up with a win. Dabu spots up from 15 off the glass, first basket. Para sa home masters. One of the newest players para sa team ng uh, home masters. A big part in, this, in their success run. As they aim to make it. 
to the semis and chased their first ever championship in the history of the UNP Cup. Ralph Tibai will inbound the ball. It seems like Coach Bennett Palad uh, may not put in his key players. You know, Luz Testiga is on the bench. Mercado, B2. Look at the rotation of Coach Bennett in the last few play dates. Hinahalo talaga niya. Oo. Saka sa totodo sa dulo. Dulo. Enriquez with a basket. And GSIS with a five-point lead. Para sa mga nag-iisip, ano, nagtatanong, ang semifinals po will start on May 3. Magpapahinga po tayo next week. And give way to some more executive face-off matches. So, aangat ang uh, NHA and PNP. Uh, shot from outside, Pareño Mimintis. Pasok na po sa semifinals ang uh, Judiciary Magis and AFP Cavaliers. So, yun po ang apat na magtatapat in the semifinals. Diaz with a spin. Wala. Mansali na tapik yung pasa. Uh, great dive by Enriquez. Trying to save it. Ayan yung mga hinahala po sa mga players, mas kinobearing eh, di ba? Sacrifice, ano? Clemente spots up. And Bansali with a rebound, sends it to Escalona on the other side. And Maki Escalona, yes! Double pound for Maki Escalona. Eight. Well, let me double check this. Ilan points na ba si Maki Escalona? May three-point basket na dalawa kanina, di ba? Oo. Double check lang natin, ha? Ay, meantime, timeout na na dito. For Coach Bennett Ballard and the Hope Masters. Nine four. Uh, back after the timeout, ng home masters Bansali for three. Ooh, all of the threes. That be the point now. Fury, Umaso. Another fast break. Escalona and Bansali have combined for the fourteen points. No GSIS. Escalona, I believe, has scored a minimum of 8 points. Para dito sa team ng GSIS, or up by 10. Matala ang uh, home masters struggling to put points on the board. Sa akin, okay lang sa puntos eh. But defensively, they have to be better. In the best of silang natakbuhan dito ng Furies, led by Escalona, Pareño from outside. Enriquez. And there's gonna be a foul on Enriquez. No. Actually, that's on Dabu. Okay, Dabu. Rav Tibai and Luz Testica are seeing action for the first time coming off the bench today. Banzali, layup off the glass is good. Now, a little update, Coach Ronnie, ngayon lang natin natanggap to. Pag manalo ang GSIS dito, and it doesn't matter kung ilang puntos, ano, as long as they win, malalaglag pa rin ang PNP. So, pag nag-triple tie. Oo, pag nag-triple tie. Masakit. So, 
GSIS can actually play spoilers dito, no? Pang panira lang ng, <laughs> ng setup. Or pwedeng mamili ng kalaban ng NHA. Kasi pag nanalo sila, ang katapat nila, I believe, mayroon ba dyan? Judicial ba? Kung magtatap sila sa quarters, meaning ang kalaban nila ay pangalawa. Kung second sila sa quarters, kalaban nila ay number one. Sa so ating notes here, it says that if they, even if they lose, sila pa rin ang number one seed. Ayun. So ang makakatapat nila ay ang AFP. AFP. Escalona shooting the lights out. Yeah. Ganda nang inilalaro ni Maki Escalona right now. Dabu sa ilalim na sundutan ni Pareño. I think Escalona has outscored the entire team ng uh, NHA so far. 21-8. Ang kalabangan. Fury is over the home masters dito sa first quarter. Okay, we're back here at the Nova Desi Convention Center. As you see yung bracketing natin dito. And there it is, Coach Ronnie. The number one uh, team sa qualifying will meet AFP. And number two will meet Judiciary. Na pasok na po sa semifinals with a better record. Pagkatapos ng eliminations. The pass is too strong para kay Tabu. Tatakbo na naman ang Furies. Escalona leading the way. And another easy layup. Could be a record-breaking night para kay Maki Escalona. Oh. Faster than a speeding bullet. Sa ilalim, Dabu! Yes! Basket and one! Started out with a 6-0 run. Talking about GSIS. The question dito, with only eight players seeing action for them, May iba ba mamaya ito? Oo. Okay, if they can maintain itong bilis na ito. There's the basket by Dabu. Dabu is at the line for the bonus shot. Namang ng 13. Ang Furies kontra sa home masters. And Sunga with the rebound. Sumaya guarding Escalona. Here is uh, Pareño. Catch and shoot. Sumaya. Dabu kicks it out. B2. Air ball. Pareño. Escalona feeling it. And this time misses from outside. Sumayang, the pass, na tapik ni Escalona. It will go the other way. Pareño, a little shake and bake. Escalona, the pass, Enriquez. Uh, rebound, Mercado. Uh, three on two break, B2. Mercado, the easy put back. Two MVPs. Two MVPs playing here para sa team ng LHA. And the only missing... Uh, gem for this team is a spot in the finals and a UNTV Cup Championship. Oh, wow. Oh, Stastica. To V2. Mercado, another big rebound. Back to back. Rebounds. Uh, this time misses the putback. Pareño catch. Oh, beautiful catch. And yeah, easy layup. Baker's doesn't lead para sa GSIS. 
Pinakamalaki kanina, 15, 23-8. Sumaya! Down to 10. Sunga doesn't get the shooter's bounce. Mercado, tumatakbo. Mercado, yes! Juventus oh. become MVP, working hard in transition. Four points off the bench for Mercado. Escalona, nice pass to Enriquez. Enriquez struggling. A um, couple of misses already. Uh, easy layup for Vito. Uh, final 18 seconds remaining. There's about nine seconds difference of top clock and game clock. That will not count. Now, uh, offensive foul, it's a towel, it's a Furies. Could have been another three point basket for the Tito Sagias. Could have been the third for the Maka Escalona. Coach Bennett Parad on your screens. Papahe Nasi Escalona, Babalik Si Pansali. Final 13 seconds of the first quarter. And from uh, being up 15 points, ang ni Furies lamang nila ng anim. Sumayang, knocked in a three kanina. Vito, mula sa labas. Yes! And the home master is coming alive late dito sa ating first quarter. Cut at 15-point deficit down to three. And they will end the second quarter with an 11-0 run. Down 15-23-8, down behind 25-22. As we are about to enter the second quarter. Point lead para sa GSIS. Pinakamalaking kalamangan nila was 15. Uh, early part ng ating first uh, quarter. Second quarter. Ice corrected. 14-0 run pala ito. Para sa home master. Yes. Well, pinasok na sila Mercado. And Vitug and Lustestica. Dizon is in the game for the first time. Para sa home masters. Banzali. Inaatrasan si Sumayang. Alfonso has it. Now Martinez driving, dishing. Sunga with the top board. Pero hindi na kuha yung tira. Vito lost it. Matatawa si Banzali. Three on one break. Uh, Banzali misses. Sunga keeping it alive. Ala. Wild sequence, Tito. Dizon has it. The pass. Luz Testiga with the basket. 16-0 run. Bridging the first and second quarters for the home masters. It is a one-point game now. 23-8. Kasamang Eric. Three minutes and 12 seconds left. Ganun kabigat yung run ng NHA. And ito. It continues. Sumayang has the ball. Ooh. Wild layup para kay Sumayang and Sunga has it. Diaz against Mercado. And Diaz does not like his odds on a one-on-one -on -one against Mercado. Bansali, yeah, foul on Sumayang. Sure, 
So Waldemar Pibay will check in for the first time. Martinez. The Sostomo also in the game for the first time. Paras uh, home masters. Nice pass by Suga. Martinez misses everything. Dizon off his leg. Oh, a lot of weird things going on. Ito sa laban na to. So GSIS, lamang pa rin sila. Hindi pa po nakakatikim ng kalamangan dito ang NHA. 5-0 here in the quarter. Pabor sa mga nakaputi. Sunga, air ball. Bounce pass for the lead. Waldemar Tibay gives the home masters the lead for the first time. 18-0 run. Para dito sa home masters. Bansali binabandayan ni Waldemar Tibay. Skip pass. Goes outside. Medyo mataas. Yung pasa. Papunta kay Martinez. Grabe yung remate ng NHA, no? <laughs> Nagpahinga lang si Maki Escalona na iba na. Prado in the game. Number 21 para sa Home Masters. He gets the touch. Prado puts it up. Ball last touch by Martinez. It will stay with the home masters with uh, 14 seconds of the shot clock. Parenyo magbabalik. Martinez magpapahinga muna. Coach Roger Yap opting with his stronger unit. His best lineup, definitely. Prado again. Zero for two. Para kay Prado. So a chance na makuha ulit yung kalamangan para kay Maki Escalona and the rest of the Furies. Escalona, binabantay ni Crisostomo. Kick out, Pareño. Going left, Pareño. Passing, taken away. Bitum. Oh. 20-0 run. Wow. After the score stood at 23-8, 3 minutes and 12 in the first quarter. Escalona dishes Diaz the pump fake. Wala pa rin. Pagkatapos ng napakadaling pagkuha ng puntos early in the first quarter, ganun naman kahirap na yung pumuntos para sa Furies. Kanina na hindi sumablay. Oh. Lahat ang binitawan, ginto. Ay naman tutukan, parang may takip. Ang sisidlan. <laughs> Para dito sa team ng uh, GSIS. Si Sid Lan. Halalim na na. <laughs> Just a little bit. <laughs> Escalona, spots up. Malayo. Ano okay. kaya itong streak na to, no? 0-15, 0-17, 0-20. Reverse, finally! Furies break the scoring drought. Pansali with the basket. First basket in nearly 8 minutes. Mercado, nothing but that. Six off the bench for the multiple, rather, the former UNTV Cup MVP. Escalona against Waldemar Tibay. Diaz. Oh, nice. The ball fake and the basket. Four points, two possessions for the big man and the rest of the Furies. B2. Difficult layup. Almost a steal by Waldemar Tibay. Escalona. Wala. Prado for three. Ooh. 0 for three for Prado. He will drive and dish. Nasundot ang bola. It will stay with the home masters. Palak will check in. Uh, Uupo muna si Crisostomo. 
Mercado, in and out. Ito si Pareño, binabantayan ni Bitug. The kick out. Again, the fake. Diaz this time drives all the way. Nasun the time. And there's going to be a foul on Mercado. Good move coming from Diaz. Hindi ito pa yung mga taga OPPMS. Nanonood. Nanonood. Yung iba. Nanonood. 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 Kanina nakaupo din sila Serrano and Sevilla Nueva. But they left already. Yeah, doon ang kasalalay ngayon ang uh, pag-asa ng OPPMS. The Latin is still here. Bang Paundo is still here. Tama, di ba? Ang daming nandito sa kaliwa. Eh? Yep. Hoping na manalo nga ang GSIS dito. Prado attacks. Prado is fouled. That's gonna be, I think, on Escalona who's gonna be called for the foul. Prado, this is his first trip to the free throw line. He has missed three shots in the three point area. Normally, part of the second unit, the coach Bennett Palan. Two for two. Maracay Prado, his first points. After missing his first three attempts. Banzali spots up. In Difficult. and out and back in again. Difficult shot. Rejecting the ball screen. Shooting in front of his defender. Restores a one-point lead. Stepping out of bounds. Sibitu. Furies, labang ng isa. They, a win here for them uh, doesn't change yung kanilang sitwasyon. They will still be out of the season as you see a basket underneath para sa Furies. Pero yung panalo nila dito will give life to OPPMS dahil malalaglag ang BNP who won earlier in overtime. Whatever happens in this matchup to give credit to Star GFIS they're playing really hard. Enriquez can't complete the three point play. That's a travel. Looking for a drop step. Instead, we lose possession. Mercado with six points off the bench. Plus six rebounds, double six for player number 22, double two, double two, double trouble. Three-point lead para kay Banzali and the Furies. Walde Martibay almost a steal, Escalona open. He was three for three kanina and now he's 0 for two. Look at Tibay's quick feet. Walde Martibay looking for an opening. Touch passing, Versado with the basket. Excellent offensive sequence. Manzali loses the ball. Ooh. Trying to dribble between the legs. While Demar Tibay, agawa ng bola dito. And Palad, Enriquez get tied up. Coach Bennett Palad. Uh... Home masters can get the lead here. Uh, possession at all. Namuri ka lang dito rin yung players ang OPPMS. Na maglalaro mamaya sa EFO. Ay OPPMS versus the Senate. Waldemar Tibay. Three games po tayo ngayon. Executive face-off coming up right after this. Nice move. Oh, a difficult shot. Naki yes, Escalona. Fancy dribbling. Basket and one. 
Faking left. Going right. Half a step. And that's all he needed to get to the basket. Maki Escalano though, missing the free throws. Prado, a long two. Yes. After the two free throws, Prado now, mas magdating tancha niya, gets his first field goal. Three point game. Sorry, the two point game. Diaz this time spots up for three. Wala. A chance for the Furies to take the lead. 36-37. Nice Catch and shoot. Yes. Mercado Week working really hard. Running the entire length of the floor and Waldemar Tibay reminding his big man for the or rewarding his big man with that nice lap pass. Pareño. Reverse block by Palad. One point lead para sa Home Masters. Steal by Banzali. Escalona, the no look pass and the basket. Enriquez with back to back baskets. One point lead direct para sa Furies. Prado for three. Oh. Pareño fouling a three-point shooter. Here it is the review on the One-point lead para sa Furies. Officials will review this. Make sure it was a three-point shot. But either way, it's going to be free throws for Prado. And they're going to find out lang kung three free throws or two free throws ba pinag-uusapan natin dito. Under a minute remaining. In the first half, kahit ano po mangyari, GSIS will bow out or tanggal na po sila sa ating season nine. But a win here by GSIS will help OPPMS because kanina po natalo ng OPPMS ng PNP in overtime, and right now temporarily PNP is. Uh, Top two sa ating quarterfinals. But a win by GSIS, aakyat po ang OPPMS and malalaglag ang PNP. So it's gonna be uh, NHA and OPPMS going to the semifinals. But a win by NHA and it's NHA and PNP going to the semifinals. So it's three free throws. Maracay Prado, he was behind the arc, and he got fouled. One for two. And one more free throw, Maracay Prado. For the lead. There it is. Second quarter scoring. A total of 21 points para dito sa NHA. 14 para sa GSIS. One point lead for the Home Masters final minute. Escalona, Diaz. Eight seconds to shoot. Escalona. Ooh. Oh! Dribbling violation contra Maki Escalona. Uh, lifting the ball. Prado. Dinaba kay Mercado ang bola. Prado again. Good defense by the Furies. Rustestica missing. And final 15 seconds, Escalona knows it, pulls back, uubusin niya na tong remaining time, and take the final shot. They want Pareño, Pareño, catch and shoot, air ball. And seven tenths remaining, 
And that's it for the first half of action. And the end of the half, that's 40 to 39 for the NHA Roman Bastards. Only 14 points para dito sa GSIS. NHA finishing the second quarter with 21 points. Is it the love dimension returns for the green shirts? Or will they have enough in their tank to regain second win in the last 20 minutes? NHA recovered its bearings as the starters who came off the bench. 14 second unit points. NHA safely in the semis. Yes, I yes, out of the semis. But OPPMS watching intently for the game result of this final match of the quarterfinals. This portion is brought to us by KDR Music House Productions. At this afternoon, let's all welcome at Center Court a new, or Center Court rather, a new recording artist of Police Records, upcoming pop balladeer, featured artist, and touring in the U.S. and Canada alongside with Casey Tandingan, South Border, River Maya, and others. To sing his latest single, Dinaba, let's all say hello to Cedric Escobar. Hello, hello, hello. Magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. Ako po si Cedric Escobar. And ito pong kantang kakantahin ko is just recently released po. It's a ballad, heartbreak ballad. Meron po ba ditong may pinagdadaanan? Or may, sino po dito ang nagmahal? Sino po dito ang gustong humingi ng isang pagkakataon sa minahal nila? Humingi po ng tawad. Ito pong kantang to, baka po makarelate kayo. Title po ay di na ba? Let's go. Oh, 
But I just wonder, no, you've been touring around the US and Canada, but what made you decide to come back here in the Philippines? Ah, so, sa pagko-concert ko po, pagko-tour ko po sa US and Canada, nakakakita po ako ng iba't ibang mga Filipino crowd. At talaga pong nakakataba ng puso pag nakita yung mag-appreciate at magtangkilik ng mga artista yung mga Pilipino. Ganun mo, tama po ba? Masarap po magmahal ang Pilipino, kaya po ako nandito. I would have to agree on that one, no, Cedric. But I also heard you have upcoming mall tours. Please go ahead and promote it. Ah, uh, yes po. So, may mga mall tours po kami. You can check them out sa Instagram ko po at Ced Sings kung mga dates po nila. Pero sa May 5 po, nasa Robinsons, Manila kami. Sa May 7, sa Ayala, Cloverleaf po. And upcoming schedules po. Tingnan nyo na po online. And your social media pages, of course. Ano ba ang Instagram mo, Facebook mo, or where can they follow you? Yes po. Uh, so sa Instagram, Facebook, uh, Instagram ko po, tsaka TikTok, and YouTube is Sed Sings. Sa Facebook po, ang Cedric Escobar. Please follow me po. Maraming salamat, and please don't forget to follow Cedric Escobar. Thank you for joining us here at Thank the you Thank time. You. More of the basketball action when we come back. Huwag po kayong aalis. Pabalik po tayo dito sa Nova Jazzy Convention Center. Pagandang uh, 
Hapon po sa inyo lahat. It is the last quarterfinal game ngayong araw na to. NHA against GSIS. NHA po. Kahit anong mangyari, pasok po sila sa semifinals with their record dito sa quarters. Samantala ang GSIS, they're out. They're definitely out dito sa uh, season. But a win here, matutulungan nila yung isang team na natalo kanina, yung OBPMS, lost by uh, more than 7 points in overtime contra sa PNP. Right now, temporarily po, pasok ang uh, PNP in the semifinals. Well, actually, hindi pasok, but they are on top. They are the top two teams dito sa ating quarters. And yung top two teams aangat po sa semis. But yun nga, panalo ng GSIS dito, ilalaglag nila ang PNP and OPPMS sa akit ulit will be top two along with NHA na papasok to Tulak sa semifinals. 43-41. NHA lamang ng dalawa. Luz Testica mula sa labas. Wala. And Pareño with a rebound. Maki Escarona. Papasakit Pareño. Pareño drives. Reverse is good. Oh, what a shot by Pareño. Pangalawang laban pa lang po to sa ating triple header today. Mamaya po yung ating uh, executive face-off sa pagitan ng OBPMS and Senate. Kaya po may mga senador like Senator Bong Go. Pumasok na po dito kanina. So he might see action here today. Dumating na mga bossy. Yep. Tira mula sa labas. No good. And kasi Pareño itatakbo ang bola. Escalona asking for it. Pareño elects to spot up. We're tied at 43. Prado mula sa labas. Uh, 0 for 4 na si Prado from 3-point area. Galing. Yeah, Pareño. What a layup. Nice pass. Great layup. Okay, Escalona has been trying to set up his teammates since the first two quarters. Pero maraming sablay from point blank. Uh, nevertheless, Escalona in double digits with 17. At least 12 of those in the first 10 minutes. Uh -oh. Only Sung has not scored for them together with Martinez. But once again, this team is fighting hard. Staying close. Tumayang spots up. He had a three in the first quarter. That's his second three. It was his basket that triggered the first uprising para dito sa NHA and eventually were ahead by as much as five earlier. Escalona. Long two. Wala. Sumayang with the rebound. Lustestica. Mercado running. Nice pass by Vitu for the basket. In, in a quest for a championship. Sometimes luck also plays a lot, no? Uh -oh. Staying healthy, staying away from injuries late in the con in the competition. Tignan mo kung gano'ng karaming players ang NHA. Kompleto nga, no? Pero, in the middle of the tournament, marami naman nasaktan sa kanila, di ba? Pero nakapalik na eh. Nag-break ng holidays, nag-break ng Holy Week. Uh Oo. -oh. Pareño with two straight layups. Uh, but unable to complete yung three-point play. Ito si Luz Testica mula sa labas. In and out. Escalona. Ball taken away. Still the Waldemar Tibay. Sumayang, yes. Si Pag Sumayang po sa Warner. 13 points for Sumayang. Masipag talaga sa kamautak. Uh -oh. That was, however, a good two-way play coming from uh, Tibay. And again. And again. The pass. Same result. Back-to-back steals, back-to-back -back baskets. Para kay Sumayang. And that's 15 points for Sumayang to lead all home masters. Tying their biggest lead of this match after being behind by 15 at 23-8. Almost a steal again. Escalona. 
driving hard to the basket, short, Mercado the rebound. Banzali almost a steal. Fifty-two forty-seven. Home masters, Laban ng lima. Here in the third quarter, Dizon getting ready to check in. I think he will before the inbound. Yes, he's best to come with Papa Hinga. Tibay. Last touch by Banzali. 14 seconds on the shot. Banzali. Ito si Escalona. One against four. Looking for a teammate. Uh, Pareño has it. Exactly five minutes na lalabi sa ating third quarter. Banzali. Catch and shoot. Yes. Second three para kay Banzali. Continues to be one of the best players here in the UNTV Cup. And this thing will be solid heading to season 10. Oh. In the Banzali Escalona. Combination in the backcourt. Nice catch. And drive to the basket para kay Mercado. 14 points, 8 rebounds for the former UNTV Cup MVP. Escalona goes baseline. And a turnover para sa Furies. Bitug. Step back. Long two. Yes. Leading scorer para sa NHA. Knocking in a seven point. Six point lead by the uh, home masters. Banzali Diaz Mula Salabas. And Juan de Martibay. The bounce pass. Vito. Back to back basket. Good passing game for Juan de Martibay. Three assists. All in the quarter. The Lawaki Sumayang is a Kevito. Eight point lead for the home masters. Uh, Diaz, last touch. Napako na ng bahagya itong uh, GSIS sa 50. 11 in the quarter para sa kanila. 18 para sa builders. Bitug nasuntan sa likod ni Escalona. Mercado trying to take it away, pero Martinez will get the ball. Ito, steal by Dizon. Adolfo missing. Adolfo will try and get it back, uh, commit the foul sa paghapul ng bola. Banzali. Benelike Escalona. 15 on the shot clock para sa Furies. Under 3 minutes. Talalabit. Waldemar Tibay. Pinasa ang bola. B2. Tres. Wala. And both teams uh, struggling. Wala sa field. Escalona. One against two. Escalona. Beautiful. Step through. Yes. Leading scorer para sa Yes, I yes. Escalona now with 19. Gonzali with 12. That's 31 of the 52. Bito. Adolfo. Pinabayaan. Esunga. Good box out. Ito rin naman si Escalona. Has a shot at it. One on one against Waldemar Tibay. Uh, Mintis nga lang. Two 
Escalona again on the break. Escalona challenging B2 short back to back misses. And Escalona wants uh, relief. And he gives him substitution dito. B2 mula sa labas. Wow. NHA naman ngayon. Back to back misses. D zone spots up. Put back, wala pa rin. Mercado, will this be the basket? No, wala, but there is going to be a foul. May tatawag sa Fury. Lakas. It's about 6-6. Strip to the line for the Mercado. One minute, 32 seconds remaining in the third quarter. Ooh. Back to back misses for the Mercado. Pareño, may hawak ng bola. Banzali. Escalona sitting down, getting some rest. Martinez spots up. Suma keeping it alive with the offensive rebound. Pareño, short. Mercado with the defensive board. Dizon, spinning. Dizon, spots up. Wala. Bitum with the offensive rebound this time. Spots up. Gonzali to Pareño for the layup. To one play, Gonzali and Pareño. Cutting what was once an eight-point lead to just a two-possession lead for the Masters. But Mercado will answer. 80% from the field, Marvin Mercado. 16 points total. Six-point lead, home Masters. Gonzali Pareño is a knockdown oh. shooter, pero wala doon. Adolfo was all alone. Panandalian. Nakahabol si Pareño. Nice pass. Four against one. Adolfo. Nice yes. pass. Yes. Good brothers. Good passing game. That's Lal Tibay is in the game. Um, B2 with the deflection. The builders have scored 43 points in the last two quarters. Have given up only a total of 27. After being behind 23-18, three-minute mark in the first quarter. Quarterfinal matchup between NHA and GSIS, and it's still anybody's game. Uh, with just a, an eight-point lead, Dito, para sa home masters, 62-54 contra sa Furies. Alalena natin sa mga kasambahay. GSIS wins today as Pareño knocks the three. PNP po malalaglag from. The quarterfinals. Samantala pagdanalo ang uh, NHA. Naglag ang OP PMS. D-Zone in traffic. Yes. Pagnanalo ang... Pagnanalo ang ano, di ba, Rick? Pagnanalo ang GSIS. Naglag ang PNP. PNP. Bansali. Nice pass. Nice. 
Last Tibay, Dijon sa gitna, binalik kay Vitug, Vitug spots up, yes. Nine point lead, good start here in the fourth for the Masters. Escalona using the pick by Diaz. Diaz, the handoff back to Escalona. Ten seconds on the shot clock. Maki to Enriquez. Back to back misses para kay Enriquez. Vitug all alone. Yes. Coach Roger Yap. Sensing danger. Feeling the juggernaut goes for ceasefire to try and stymie this four-quarter surge coming from the home masters. Eight twenty three remaining south in fourth quarter. GSIS uh, trailing by eleven. Sixty eight fifty seven the quarter final match of Enriquez with a catch. Enriquez back to back to back misses already. Enriquez continues to miss inside. Normally his favorite playing uh or rather his favorite playground. Uh -oh. High percentage player to Rique. Mercado with 16, Sumayang with 15, Vito with 13. Three players, I believe, who played off the bench today. We got them second unit scoring. One for two. Para kay Sunga at the line. It is a 10 point game. First basketball, first points by any Sunga. First point. Okay. Sunga. Yep, that's his first point of the game. Diaz with the rebound. Ito si Pareño, tatakbo, but no numbers para sa Furies. They are slow to come down. Escalona. Pareño. Pareño struggling from outside. Once again, this is a team which just lost their leading scorer, James Abugan. Oh. This team was in contention for a semi spot. Oh, Luke's testing a knocks in a three. Two time MVP knocks in his first three ball to give his team the biggest advantage at 13. 71-58. Nice pass. Sunga underneath. Supalpal by Dabu. Diaz. And Rafi by may have a ball. There's going to be a foul by Diaz here. In the end, it boiled down to light bodies and flesh legs. Kasama ngayon. Uh -oh. But in terms of fight, hindi naman nangayaw dito ang GSIS eh. Kulang lang talaga. Kulang sa tao. They only have an eight-man lineup dito sa larong ito. Pass too high para kay Dabu. Mistestika knocked in a three kanina. He has had control panandalian pero he lost it. Baseline inbound. Chrysostomo. No ball almost stolen by Escalona. B2, binabatay ni Pareño. B2 rises and knocks it in. Top shot para kay Alvin B2. That's the way he plays. 15 for B2. And his heart is really hot. Pareño. Drives, dishes, 
Escalona gets it almost. Dituk has it now. And a foul by Enriquez. Eleven four in the quarter. In favor of the white shirts. And Luz Testiga with a three-pointer. Make that 14-4 in the quarter. Wow. After we ended the third quarter, 62 to 50 to 54. Yeah, it's going to be a foul on Escalona. Oh, sorry, on uh, uh, which is Baltimore Pibay against Escalona. It's now an 18 point lead para sa home masters. No more ball, no? Oh. Pass. Escalona to Diaz. And there's going to be a foul on Luz Testica. Slowly, you know. Hindi ganun kabigla yung uh, pag-arangkada nitong uh, home masters. They slowly built this lead. And uh, now, comfortable and comfortable sila ahead. Diaz at the line. Short on the first attempt. Alala ko yung first game kanina, Rick. Nagtabla tayo, 86 only. <laughs> <clears throat> and then, as a team, talking about PNP, was needed to win by 7 points. Uh -oh. Outscored OPPMS 17-3. Wow, in overtime. In overtime. But, despite yung effort na yun, Coach Ronnie, they are still not assured until the final buzzer <laughs> kung saan manalo ang NHJ. Touch pass by Clemente. Dabu. Yes. And right now, maganda ang position ng NHJ dito. They're up 19 already. 12 to here in the quarter para sa kanila. Escalona, nanlamig na mula sa labas. Diaz, the putback is good. Nice time to write 16-5, make that 16-7 after that last basket coming from Diaz. 23-8 kanina to, ah. Oh. Since that time, 70 against... 38. Wow. Oh, Luz oh, mula sa labas. It's not a two-time MVP, MVP for nothing. Down 15, now up 20. That's off Diaz. Maki Escalona saying, uh, my fault, yung pass ako, too low. Uh, time out by uh, Coach Bennett Ballard. Uh, they are up by 20. 81-61. Pero may shooter. Ito umaakat to eh. Ito umaakat to pag nandun yung shooter. Ha? May shooter ah. Huwag kayo magdalwa dito sa isang tao. Isa lang. Ha? NHJ looking like the number one team in the quarterfinals, up by 20 contra sa GSIS. Adolfo misses. Uh, offensive rebound. Para sa home masters, Clemente, they swing it around. Adolfo, eight seconds to shoot. Clemente left alone. Clemente Ooh. picks up his own miss. Clemente baseline. Shot from outside, no good. Tabu trying to keep it alive. Uh, foul by Adolfo. <laughs> <Baka sakali. laughs> so impressed by, you know, some of some of the senior members that NHA coach Ronnie. Yeah, still team, play hey, yes. at this level, you know, like si Adolfo. That's not that's not easy to practice with this unit. Mahirap yun rin. Sabaya mo yung stamina ng mga to. Wow. First basket for Martinez. 
Clemente. Wala pa rin. A big rebound para kay Dabu. Ito si Adolfo. Inside to Dabu. Dabu fades away. In and out. Martinez, malakas. Oh! Napunta kay Suna. And the pass to Diaz for the basket. Five points, two possessions. Coach Bennett sensing danger calls a timeout here in the fourth. Start na naman tayo tubira sa labas. Shoot mo na lang, hold nilabas mo pa. Ikaw rin. Yan sabi ko pag tapo. Isa lang yun, pahari. ng uh, lima ang kalamangan ng... Uh, Home Masters, Coach Bennett, tapat awag ng timeout, and we saw him very animated along the sidelines talking to his team. Clemente, dribble between the legs, sinikot ang bola, Adolfo steps into a long two short. But Tabu with another offensive rebound, Clemente. Ito si Luz Testica rises, uh, this time a miss after knocking in at least two straight earlier. Martinez. Yes! Basket from the corner. Seven straight points. And the 19 point lead is down to 12. No beat again side. Ibabalik na ni Coach Bennett shortly. Big rebound by Dabu. Dabu, yes! Oh, they needed that. Dabu with 10. Four players in double figures. Make that five. Arasal Masters for the 14 point lead. Alfonso, nakatres ka rin a skip pass para kay Martinez. Ito si Escalona back to Alfonso. Alfonso for three. Alfonso keeping it alive. Good hustle. Escalona. A drop pass. And Diaz with a basket. Diaz with 10. And we're down to the last two minutes of this last quarter final matchup. GSIS out of contention. Pero a win here will give OPPMS the slot sa semifinals. A win by NHA, PNP naman ang papasok. Bruce Testica puts it in. And the last second. Akala ko may nag-time out eh. <laughs> that will be uh, the nail on the coffin. Thrown by the builders on the Furies. Dabu, after a miss by Alfonso. Final one and a half, Clemente with the basket. Martinez all alone. And para sa PNP responders, makakahinga na sila na maluwa, go yes, Johnny. Yes, yes, yes. With this lead by NHA. Final minute of the fourth quarter. Woo! For OPPMS. That's it for their season along with GSIS. Both will bow out to season 9. And uh, better luck to season 10. Dabu, short. Kala mo, pasok, no? Nothing but net. Ito nung Whoa! Diaz! Walking on air. <laughs> Steal by Adolfo. And the crowd is cheering here. And one second separate game and shot clock, and Home Masters will dribble the time away. May malalabi pang one second. So this will be a 24. No, actually, no busay ora. So they sync the clock already. So that will be it. At the buzzer, NHA and PNP move up to the semifinals as we say goodbye. Para sa OPPMS and GSIS, a great effort uh, in Season 9, but not good enough.
The cast is complete. Yep. Judiciary top team will square off. I believe with the uh, double check me. PNP. Samantalang ang AFP lalaban sa top team here in the quarters ang third best team ang LSA Builders and that will be the face-off in the semifinals at uh, maliwanag those are champion teams except for LHA two-time champions Judiciary Magis AFP Cavaliers the winningest team in the history of the UNTV Cup PNP one-time UNTV Cup champions LHA looking to crash the party as OTPMS and GSIS will bid the competition goodbye. From 12 teams, we're down to only four, and that will resume a week after next Sunday. That's right. Let's go to Rina Villamar Camara with our best players of the game. Rina. Thank you so much, Sir Eric Tipan and Coach Ronnie Magsanok, our best players from the NHA Home Masters. We have Marvin Mercado and Rodolfo Sumayang. First up, ito muna si Marvin Mercado. You are now in the semifinals. May po nga pagbabago ba kayo when it comes to your practices? Mas magiging strict ba sa inyo si Coach? Uh, actually, uh, strict na si Coach uh, mula pa ng simula. So, mas hihigpis palalo siguro yung practice namin ngayon. So, pat, pati nga mga cellphone namin, tatanggalin yung cellphone namin para mawala yung distraction sa amin. Seryoso ngayon, pasok ng semis para maganda ilaro namin. Rodolfo, this is not the first time na papasok ang kupo na ng NHA Home Masters sa semis. This is the fourth time actually, no? Ano yung mga babaguhin nyo para naman makaangat kayo dun sa team standings na hindi lamang sa semis pero makakarating din kayo sa finals natin? Uh, kailangan namin kung mga nakapasok kami ng mga nakaraang prep ng nakaraang semis uh, ngayon, 100%. Kung kailangan gagawin namin 200 or 300% yung mga sipag at practice na gagawin namin. Sabi nga ni Marvin, Masyadong hinihigpitan na kami ni Coach Bennett, kaya kailangan talaga pumukpok talaga kami. Alam ko may mga listahan ka dyan na mga gusto mong batiin. Please go ahead. Binabati ko nga pala si GM Joventay, si AGM Eric Ibanez, Attorney Serge Domasian, Sir Charles Kimpo, Sir Coco Tevez ng CPD, uh, Information Division, yung division ko, uh, NHA... NHA community, uh, binabati ko pala yung asawa ko sa Laguna, yung parents ko dito sa QC. Tapos yung mga bayaw ko sa Laguna. Tapos yung baby ko. Maraming salamat, Rodolfo. Marvin, go ahead sa mga greetings mo naman. Uh, Unang-una, binabati ko si GM Joventhai. Salamat po sa pag-suporta uh, pag sa amin. Hangga, mula simula, hanggang dito kami na semifinals na po tayo ngayon. So, si AGM uh, Roderick Ibanez, si Attorney Serge Tomasian, uh, team manager namin. Maraming salamat sa support, uh, sir. Attorney Serge, then si Sir, Sir Charles Kimpo. Tapos po ang boss ko sa department namin sa NHA, si Boss Christine Permalino, uh, Sir Don Hill Alcain and Ma'am Boots. Uh, si Attorney Lynn Shacon po, group manager namin sa HSSG. The whole, the whole NHA community, uh, my family, uh, family ni Tibay, na uh, nung Tibay Twins namin, nandito, nunod sila. Si Attorney John Christopher Mahamud, na walang, uh, hanggang ngayon, sumusuporta pa rin sa amin. Maraming salamat, Sir. Ah, uh, may uh, asawa ko, uh, si Paula, si Andre no, no diyan sa bahay, tapos si Kenyon, anak ko. Tapos si mga friends ko diyan, mga boss ko, AC, uh, boss ACS, RBMC, uh, ball up, ball up ano, ball up uh, tailoring. Thank you. Napati ko kayo lahat diyan. Salamat po. Maraming salamat Marvin Mercado and of course Adolfo Sumay ang ating best players of this ball game. Finally, pasok na po sila sa ating semifinals round kung saan makakalaban po nila at makakaharap nila ang kuponan ng AFP Cavaliers. Now coming right up, we have our executive face-off. It's the OP executive versus the Senate Sentinels. Don't go away.
Check, check, check. It's time now for UNTV Cup Executive Face Off versus the live here at the Nova Desi Convention Center. Again, my name is Rina Valiamora Camara. Now it's the OP Executives going up against the Senate Sentinels. And for those of you who just tuned in, ito po ang ating game recap on our first two games in the quarters earlier. Sa ating unang game, nanalo po dyan ang kupuna ng PNP Responders contra sa OPPMS with the scores 103-289. At katatapos lamang po ng ating second game kung saan nang muna po dyan ang NHA Home Masters contra sa GSIS with the score. 88 to 71. Dahil po dyan na maglalaban na po sa ating semifinals round ang Judiciary Contest sa PNP at ang AFP naman, makakatunggali po nila dyan ang kuponan ng NHA Home Masters. At this point, habang naghahanda po ang dalawang kuponan sa akin ni Kuran, silipin po muna natin ang naging team preparation ng OP Executives. Let's watch this. <coughs> Pagsali ng Presidential Management Staff o PMS sa Season 9 ng UNTV Cup ay hindi na nila pinalampas ang pakikinahok ng ahensya sa Executive Face-Off 2023. Nagbigay sila ng invitation sa mga executive level na mga ahensya na directly under the office of the President upang makasama sa lineup ng OP Executive Steve. Actually, nalaman ko kasi when I, when I was working in PMS, no? Nalaman ko na yung mga employees, na, yung ibang staff ng PMS, form the team para sumali sa UNTV. Eh, dati ako nagbabasketball. Eh, yung mga ibang kasama ko, I, I found out na nasa gobyerno ko rin sila. So, in-invite ko sila. Sabi ko, pare, tayo tayo ng team para balik natin yung mga dating laro natin. So, yun. Pero ngayon, medyo nagsisisi ng konti kasi medyo masakit na pala yung mga tuhod. <laughs> <laughs> Pero ano naman, sempre after nung ano, after nung pandemic, uh, almost 2 3 years kami hindi naglaro. So we're trying to get our conditioning back. Laking pasasalamat ng kanilang head coach na maraming tumugon sa kanilang ahensya upang paglaro sa executive face off ng UNTV Cup. Ngunit ang malaking challenge sa kanilang team ay ang makumpleto ang kanilang players tuwing practice nila dahil sa magkakaiba nilang schedule. Initially, uh, uh, ano din siya, challenge din siya kasi hindi namin alam sa kami kukuha ng players. So nung nagsabi naman kami sa different offices, biglang ang daming gusto sumali. Kaya 18 kami actually. Siyempre, uh, it's for the beneficiary. We're playing sa UNTV dahil sa mga beneficiaries, di ba? Uh, so, hopefully, mag maganda yung maging performance ng team para naman mas malaki-laki yung maibigay dun sa beneficiary namin. Uh, we all know naman na uh, we have very busy schedules. Particularly uh, kami, no, na nasa Office of the President, on-call talaga ang trabaho. But we try to make time. No? We, we, we always communicate with each other. 
and we try to schedule yung practices namin kung kailan talaga available lahat ng tao. Uh, and syempre, hindi rin naman natin may iwasan minsan. May mga family affairs. Pero ano na lang yan eh, it's really a matter of dedication. And at the same time, si Coach, lagi kami sinasabihan na huwag kalimutan na mag, mag, ano, mag-try to condition yourself. So jogging-jogging, mag-workout ka by yourself. Yun. And uh, I think nang dahil magkakakilala naman kami at saka magkakaibigan na kami from way before, eh, alam naman na namin yung dedication ng bawat isa. Well, ito nga, uh, nag-iensayo kami lagi no? Ngayon, uh, as a team na and uh, sumasama kami sa ensayo din ng uh, regular na team ng uh, OP para sa ganyan na uh, uh, mas marami kami uh, at talagang uh, may ensayo yung cardio namin kasi lalo na sa amin, bihira sa amin may time eh, na maglaro. So, at least dito, sa uh, siguro twice or twice a week na practice, mabibuild up yung stamina namin at makasabay kami kahit papan. Kaya puspusan din ang preparation ng coaching staff para makasasabay pa rin ang players sa competitiveness ng liga. So ngayon, eh, sinasabay namin sila sa regular team. Hopefully, hindi sila mabigla dahil siyempre, pag napasabay sila sa bata, baka biglang kayaanin nila yung ginagawa ng mga bata, mabigla sila. So, yun. Uh, sabi ko lang, uh, hindi sapat yung preparation natin dito sa practices natin. So you should have your uh, exercise na walking and jogging will be a big help para lang in preparation for the executive phase of series. In, as a team, hindi pa kami nag-practice na kami lang, executives lang. So ang ginagawa namin, like today, sinasabay lang namin sila sa mga regulars. Kasi nga, baka pag nagpa-practice ako ng executive, aani man dumating, wala, walang mangyari sa practice namin. Dahil siyempre, pag mga ganyang level na, hindi mo naman sila pwede oh, umaten kayo. So it's not that easy. Well, expect ko na mag-enjoy kami lahat, uh, especially iba't ibang mga government agencies yung mga kalaban natin, uh, mga kabuta ng kamaraderi, siyempre, pare-pare sa servisyo. At uh, siyempre, may ibabaw dyan yung pag, uh, pama- pagmamahal natin lahat sa basketball. Siyempre, ano naman, yung competition, di ba? Uh, hindi naman mawawala yan. Uh, pag nagbabasketball ka talaga, uh, gusto mo rin naman yung nasa-challenge ka, di ba? Yung uh, nahihirapan kayo kasi it brings out the best in all of you. So, Doon din lalabas yung friendship nyo, yung camaraderie, saka siyempre yung sportsmanship. Pag, hindi naman lahat pwedeng, hindi naman lahat ng laro mapapanalo mo. Minsan, kailangan mo rin tamanggap ng talo. But you always try to do your best. And that's, That's what uh, draws all of us to play basketball. There you have it, mga kasambahay, ang naging team preparation ng OP executives. Mamaya po, abangan nyo naman po ang naging team preparation ng Senate Sentinels. At this point, good luck to both teams. Bibigay ko na kay uh, Coach Jolly Escobar and Coach Ronnie Magsano. Good afternoon, and we are still in the uh, Novadesi gym. Dito po sa may uh, Novadesi. This is going to be our third game. Uh, blessed Sunday to uh, everybody. Um, meron po tayong uh, four uh, semifinalists dun sa ating UNTV Cup. Pero ito, very interesting. Coach Ronnie, this is, tawagin natin parang a spin-off yung UNTV Cup natin. This is the executive phase of Tell us, Coach Ronnie, a little bit about the executive phase. Correct. This is, uh, of course, the version of UNTV Cup. Para sa ating mga ehekutibo. Yes. Yes. At uh, tayo ay maglalaro ng 26 games. At na kinabibilangan ng 17. And this is game number 5 sa 26 games na nakalatag sa executive face-off. Uh, dati lang nagwagi ang uh, judiciary, of course, okay. sa labanan ng executive face-off. Samantalang makikita nyo sa inyong mga screens, si Senator Bongo, sa kanilang debut game. Napakahilig mag-basketball. Sobra, shooter yan. Sa unang yeah. laban ng Senado dito sa executive face-off against a team which won their first match against GSIS last April 2 as Franz Alvarez had a 20.19 rebound performance in giving the OPPMS their first win looking for their second straight and a yes. on the top spot. Oo nga, well, uh, nasa tawagin natin parang infancy stage pa lang ng uh, executive phase of ito ay eh, yung first game na ito ng, uh, ng Senate. Uh, Tama. Coach Ronnie, eh, huwag na natin patagalin. Let's see kung uh, ano, sino mga lineups dito will go na to Noel Villan. 
Good evening and welcome to the Nova Desi Convention Center for tonight's executive face-off in Season 9 of the UNTV Cup, Ang Liga ng Public Servants. Let's welcome in first your OP executives. Number 3, Attorney Hubert Guevara. Number 4, Attorney Reynold Monsayap. Number 5, Assistant Secretary Jeffrey Gallardo. Number 7, Franz Alvarez. Number 8, Roden Marks Gatdula. Number 10, Assistant Secretary Montalo Nazario Jr. Number 11, Jerome Rodillo. Number 13, Attorney Carlo Paulino. Number 14, Hector Melencio. Number 15, Attorney Erickson Luce. Number 18, Mark Lapid. Number 19, Under Secretary Rodolfo Palatao de Fort. Number 22, Marvin Bayam. Number 26, Juanito Sanyosa. Number 28, Assistant Secretary Jose Canlas. Number 30, Under Secretary Mark Pastor. Number 92, Brian Gabriel. And number 99, Assistant Secretary Jericho Acedera. Your head coach is Romano Fernandez. Assistant coaches are Melvin Virtis, John Michael Jimenez, and Jerick Galiza. Now give it up for your Senate Sentinels. Number one, Carl Paraon. Number two, the Honorable Senator Bongo. Number three, the Honorable Senator Joel Villanueva. Number five, Ronald Golding. Number seven, the Honorable Senator Sonny Angara. Number eight, the Honorable Senator Mark Villar. Number nine, Benjamin Navea. Number ten, Warrenton. Number eleven, Javier Lais. Number twelve, Ray Malaga. Number eighteen, Francisco Acedillo. Number twenty-three, Christian Andaya. Number twenty-five, Reynante Langit. Number thirty-one, Jonel Sangalang. Number 44, Joey Flaminiano. Number 55, Renato Sison. Number 77, Daniel D. Yamson. And number 88, Elbert Cruz. Their coaches are Mike Furman and Tata Furman. Let's uh, first meet the starting five of your OP executives. At card number three, Hubert Guevara. The other guard, number 26, Juanito Sanyosa. At center, number 7, Franz Alvarez. At forward, number 19, Rodolfo Palatao. In the other forward, number 18, Mark Lapid. Here now is the starting lineup of your Senate Sentinels. At guard, number 2, the Honorable Senator, Bongo. The other guard, number 23, Christian Andaya. At center, number 11, Javier Laez. At forward, number 12, Ray Malaga. In the other forward, number 31, Jonel Sangalam. Officiating this ballgame are Ruben Agbalo, Henio Flores, and Edwin De Vera. Ng ating UNTV Cup Arena, what do you have for us? 
Yes, Coach Jolly, battle, battle of the executives is more challenging and exciting. A test of patience and a test of wisdom for the players. Meanwhile, a test of being open-minded for Coach Mike Fermin to lessen his expectations from the team. As a difference uh, of handling a regular team and the executives team, he said skills-wise, speed-wise, and execution-wise, it's not the same. You know, they practice twice a week dito sa Senate Sentinels for three hours. Three hours daw dahil may mga oras dyan na nag-aantayan pa sila inside the court. So far, Coach Mike Fermin said that they are competitive and hopefully they will be efficient inside the court. Coach Jolly? Thank you, Nina. At nakita ko, Coach Jolly, oh, the, uh, we've seen him play in the past, Senator Bongo does not pass up yung mga, <laughs> pag may open look siya, magmula sa arc of. This time, siguro, pasa-pasa muna, pero ako, tingin ko, once he has an open look from three-point area, fire, fire ito na siya. <laughs> Center Bongo. Pero nasa depensa mo na sila Coach Roni. Oh, nice. First three-point basket para sa White Shirts. Miller Alvarez score, the president of PNOC. Yeah. Scoring his first basket, coming off a huge 20 and 19 production. Mm. Sa kanilang 44-point uh, win as go. Now, Senator Bongo misses his first three-point attempt. Nilinis lamang yung rim. Pero ayun na nga, lumabas yung kanyang tira. Still nothing on the board para dito sa Senate. This is a baseline jumper. Magmula sa OP office of the President Executive. And there's their, bear, uh, first, uh, their first basket of this ball game. Alvarez uh, sa may ilalim. Seven points in the first minute oh, and 40. Four of those seven points coming from uh, Alvarez. As we also take a look at Mark Lapid starting out today for the office of the President. Uh, same uh, same area for uh, Senator Bongo, pero di pa rin pumasok from that left uh, corner. Malaga, Andaya, Bongo, Sangalang, Laiz, ang lima para sa Senate. Malaga place for Team A ng Senado. Oo. Yeah, kailangan siyempre yun ang mga executives ng mga... Uh, uh, back up na matinde and there he is right here you can see uh, Malaga all the way to Sangalang on the other side nice extra passage para sa Senate para sa first basket dito sa ating ball you remember him well used to play for the executives ng uh, Senado before itong si Andaya one of the best three pointer hindi na ipasok Sanyosa now to uh, Guevara What's the free throw area? Uh, free throw area. Papasok po yan. 9 to 2. Good ball movement after that recovery. Inside basket. Sangalang. Bucket para sa Senate. Hot start para dito sa OP coach, Ronnie. Two inside baskets para dito sa Senado. Uh -huh. Guevara again uh, from that area, short from uh, kanyang uh, subo from the arc. Another try from the three-point area is not there para sa OP. OP executives is office of the president executives. Empty possessions sila, pero they have a uh, five-point lead here. Seven teams, Coach Ron, you know, seven teams in total. Seven teams will play a total of six games each. Only the top four will make it yeah. to the final four. Single round robin. You want to, uh... 26, 26 games. Okay. Ito ay pang lima. Oh. Sa 26 matches sa uh, executive phase of. So, uh, early on, Coach Ron, you want to, debat, you want to garner some uh, early wins na kaagad. Sabi nga ni Coach Ron, Three of those seven teams will not make it. You want to be part of the top four, as we see an important basket para dito kay uh, Lies. Uh, na sila just early in the ball game. Short ang unang uh, free throw. Gagalaw ang score. Still a five-point uh, office of the president advantage. Ang lakas ang line-up ng Senado. Huh? Wala. Oh, 
mahirap lang because he mentioned na he's the executive. Uh, yung mga ehekutibo eh, sila, sabi mo. Bones na very busy. No? Busy, so, oh. <laughs> Hinahanap ko yung kibigan natin, yung player ng USD. Si uh, Joel Villanueva is not here. Senator Joel Villanueva. Oh. Senator Sally Angara, oh, not here. Oh. Ako ng basket. Ang hilig din nun, Coach Ronnie. Then, oh, then, yeah. NBA, PBA, this is why he's playing here. Pero again, not here today dahil uh, siguro talagang uh, busy today yung dalawang na mention ni uh, Coach Ronnie Ronald Golding meanwhile para sa Senate nothing there nice pass ng maganda ang transition defense ng Senate empty possession sanggalang will clear here comes Senator Dong Go pa-facilitate muna siya <laughs> Malakas. Over the backboard and tira empty possession ng Senate. Kanina nga yung report ni Rina, Coach Ronnie, no? tatlong oras daw sila nag ensayo I'm sure, Twice a week. Pag, oh, pag nagkita-kita sila, ito todo na nila yung pag ensayo kasi they definitely cannot go on a day-to-day. Guevara will be nudged by Malaga. <laughs> I see lots of smiles, Coach Ronnie. And it's like one of those Sunday games. important. <laughs> 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 Pag uh, edad na namin kayo, maraming stretching, tapos pagtapos maraming yelo. No? Yan. <laughs> hindi sa halo-halo, kundi sa mga paa. <laughs> sa tuhod, sa paa. Another, sa kasukasuan. <laughs> sa kasukasuan. Very important. Bongo, nagbababa ng bola. Change direction. Nawala ang bola. Here comes OP. Nawala din. Langit. To Malaga. Malaga will lose it as well. Lapid. A long pass. Good intention. In control, oh. One minute line. Substitutions dito para sa Optical President Executive. Masyado bumagalaw ang ating score dito, 9 to 5. There was a free throw earlier. Langit from the left side. Nothing there for uh, the Senate. 4 minutes and 14. First quarter pa lamang po ito. Ooh. Ronald Golding will foul. Uh, now, by, uh, Ronald Golding is first. 4 on the second. Sideline ang ating throw in. 17 second shot. Bayang to Pastor. Back to Bayang. To the nice move. Yes. One one. Going to his weak side, no problem. Double punt basket. Well, Coach Ronnie, if you see somebody who's in their probably mid-twenties or thirties, merong advantage because they Wala, yung mga, mga fresh <laughs> mga fresh ang mga legs na mga to. Tulad ng numero 22 na si uh, Ina nga, si Bayang. So, naka, naka, nakaka-recover yan. Nakaka-recover yan. Hindi yung kailangan kang lumabas para makarecover. <laughs> Kita natin yung kanyang magandang atake. Gives uh, OP a six-point lead. Ronald Golding. Ito, kaibigan natin ito eh. Pagal na sa Senate talaga. They will lose it though. Ito na naman siya. The very young player of the uh, office of the president. Kaya mapapindot ng buzzer. Ang uh, kukunan ng Senate dahil... Uh, Lamang na ng ocho ang off the press. Ah, uh, isang magandang setup lang, no? Okay. Uh, Senbong ito, eh. Senbong, okay. We push corner. Ah, uh, Pat. Yes. JR to, di ba? JR. Sir Gold, ikaw na to. Oo. Oh. Bob, ikaw na to, ha? Okay. Ah, uh, Sir Bong, ah, uh, send Bong, mag-corner mag- ka na. Siya, ha? Push mo lang siya, push mo. Push mo, Pat, alimutola, ha? Push tayo, push. Ah, uh, JR, tingin. Pag-swing, 
Atake JR. Sir, uh, sir Gold, screen tayo. JR, Atake, Pinke Pat, Pat, doon tayo kasi. Yes, yes. Corner, ha? Okay. Ah. One-two pass lang yan, ha? One-two pass. Yes, yes. Sa magandang setup lang. ng uh, mga palitan ng mga tao dito at Senate Paraon will uh, enter the ball game para dito sa Senate magmula sa kanan naman hindi maka kuha ng 3-pointer si uh, Senator Bong go all the way to the top is Bayang I think two straight layups six, for Bayang 6 straight ata to si Bayang yes Bayang going to town uh, using his uh, youth and foot speed yeah. Pumasok siya, 9-5, 6 and uh, 29 mark. Nearly 4 minutes after, he has scored a total of 6 straight points. Correct. Yun yun, Coach Roni. Uh, you said 9-5, so 6 straight, coming from Bayang. To complement a 7-0 start para dito sa OPPMS. Senate leads some baskets right here. Senator Bongo. Unable to bury the three pointers. Zero and four. Zero four in the shot. 47 on the shot. Tricky. Itong si Senator Bongo. Pag nakaisa ito. <laughs> Mga sunod-sunod ito. Paraon. Nagtitimon. That's for the Senate. Nakaasul po sila. It's a steal. Bravo. Ah, hindi. Mabalik ang bola dito sa Senate. Ten-point uh, office of the president lead is the biggest ng ating ball game. Two and a half remaining dito sa ating first quarter. This is the UNTV Cup face-off edition. Executives ng mga agencies po natin. Senator uh, Bongo will be given a breather here. Two leaders for Hector Melencio. Melencio from the free throw area. Dalawa ang kanyang ititira. Hindi nadagdagan ang kanilang uh, nice 10-point lead here. Earlier, OPPMS sa ating uh, Season 9 ng UNTV Cup suffered a uh, heartbreak of a loss in a match that they could have afforded to lose by as much as 6, but they lost in overtime. And it was a match that saw them lose the game 103-89 to bow out of contention. Yun ang the spot in the semis. Coach Ronnie, pasadaan mo real quick yung semifinalist natin sa UNTV Cup. Nag-aabang ang AFP, nag-aabang ang judiciary. Umakyat ang NHA, lalaro, of course, ang team ng PNP muli sa semifinal. Yeah, yeah nangaabangan natin. Pero before that, executive space of Parahon, pero short ang uh, putback ni Sandalang. They still have the ball. Langit. That's gonna be two, two free throws. Two, two important free throws, I'll add, para dito sa Senate dahil uh, they are down by 10. The Senate has not scored in the last five minutes. Both teams uh, are in the penalty. A minute and 44, two free throws. Nothing para dito sa Senate. Napaku sila sa, sa five points dito. Sanyosa baseline. They will keep the ball. 12 seconds sa kanilang shot clock. Naalala ko si Monsayak. Naglaro na rin dati ito sa YouTube. Uh, yeah. Nahusay ito. Parantan rebound. Tan, sa may free throw area. 
also used to play in the lovely Ronald Gold in the team A, huh? Ah, yes. Siyempre, after a while, medyo bawas ka na sa yung mga, sabi mo, kasukasuhan. So, yes, sir. Hindi ka relax-relax lang sa executive face off Pero pag mumaliin, Coach Ronnie, talagang competitive ito mga ito. Gusto manalo ng mga ito, di ba? Okay, eh. <laughs> San Yosas 3, on bottom of the net. Talagang malakal dito ang mga... Second three-point basket for San Yosas. Yeah. Biggest lead right now at 13. And this nice 8-0 run yes. since the 6-minute mark. A couple of more possessions dito sa ating uh, first quarter. Warrington is the biggest on the floor. Kaya inaaraka na sila. Will be rewarded a couple of free throws. 27 seconds remaining. Very first quarter of our ball game. Flaminiano also in para sa Senado. A dead shot shooter uh -uh. as uh, the defenders have converted one three-point basket but that's or rather no three-point baskets yet well one thing's for sure they need some uh, some points some buckets here so they're still at five points in senate last possession ito dahil parang tens tenths of a second lang yung uh, Difference the game and shot clock. Tama ba? Yeah. Bayang. Pagkapasok na, nagparamdam ka agad siya. Pero Senna, Senna gets a steal. So wanting to end uh, this first quarter. Na maganda-ganda with a basket. Sana. Senna ka. Dahil 13 na. Itong uh, kalamangan ng uh, OP. OP executives. What a hot start para sa kanila. The Senate defenders, meanwhile, did not make it to the quarters of uh, United League Cup Season uh -huh. 9. Eliminated as they lost their final game after winning their first four matches. Yes. That was a big letdown for a team that really loves to play and compete. Had a glimpse of uh, coach uh, Mike Fermin. Of the Senate, to naman yung side ng uh, Office of the President, uh, executives. Meron tayong stoppage, clarification. Suarentan, na fi na fi freeze up na din sa free throw area. Sumablay siya ng dalawa kanina. Oh, dyan. oh, wanting to, uh, wanting to get that back with two here. Naku, short pa rin. Tagal, no? Walang galawan yung kanilang score. But they need somebody to, uh, no, yung, uh, some catalyst, especially on offense, to give them some buckets. Finally, gumalaw ang kanilang score. Naging six. Kaya hmm. po magtatapos ang ating first quarter. Hot start para kay the top of the president uh, executive. 18 as he gets only the six points of uh, Senate second quarter will be right back. In the first 10 minutes, there were only two field goals scored by the Senate. Then they had converted one of seven from the free throw line. Meanwhile, OPTMS definitely feeling much better with eight field goals. And out of this eight, two came from the three ball. 
Yes. Although they were at zero out of four from the free throw line. Of course, uh, yung Senate hoping na medyo makakuha na itong si uh, Senator Bongo ng kanyang mga three-pointers. Somebody to light that fire on the uh, <coughs> offensive side of the Senate. Ayun, may, pero may, may size eh, no? May size itong uh, um, Office of the President. Okay. Wow, okay. Seeing some some big bodies dun sa may bandang ilalim para sa kanila. Senator Bongo. Hindi pa rin makabutas. Yan, magmula sa mas malapit. Ay, hindi pa rin makapasok. Mayang. Uh, nice pass. Man. Beautiful. Sinful Alvarez. Bias uh, shot at or assisted in at least eight uh -oh. points para dito sa team. No, baby. Team natulak niya. Mga... Well, Bayang, may leaks eh. May explosive na siya eh. Matap eh. So, oh, oh. Si Son Short eh. Yan na naman siya. Yeah. Yan lang. Mahirap na yung tirang yun pag hindi ka bata. Eight for Bayang off the bench. Alvarez Bayang combining for a total of 12 uh -huh. of the first 22 points and they by their combination have outscored the entire unit thanks and Correct. Correct. Of course Bayang coming in the quick 6 points para sa kanya dinagdagan ng layup ngayon 8 puntos in total at talagang umalago na gusto itong uh, office of the president executive 22 to 6 badly in need of some baskets. Senate. Ito, Ito kailangan ko ba? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I was about to say, Goy Trani. Has to take shots. Yeah. Hanapin niya, no? Hanapin niya yung uh -oh. kanyang opensa. And we're talking about the uh, young gun na si uh, Malaga. Number 12 para sa Senate po. Ayan, ganda sana ng pata. Alam din ng mga, alam ng depensa na maghahanap ng tira si Senator Bongo. Kaya lahat nagkokalap sa kanya. The last second, na-drop pass niya. Tagal ang gut foul, dalawang free throws para sa kanya. If, uh, if you've uh, just joined us, this is the executive face-off. Kumpisa lang ng ating second quarter. And in the driver's seat is Office of the President Executive. Alvarez na nagbaba ng bola. What a pass. Oh, they have to be ready. Magaling din pumasa si Bayang. Short on the fall away. Here comes the Senate. So Malaga really has to try to look for his offense here. Another nice pass. Another bucket by the OB executive. The one, one situation gives them an 8 2, an 18 point lead. Once again, Bayang connecting with Alvarez. Alvarez now with a total of uh, 8 points here in the first yeah. two quarters. Samaganda, indeed. Indeed, it's a settle for jump shot. Top of Makat, Sailale. Kasi nakakatakbo sila eh. Uh -huh. Tapos yung mga magagandang pasa ng uh, numero 22, Bayang. I think he has a couple of assists na rin dito. Make that three assists para kay Bayang. Si Senator, zero of seven yata ah. Nice pass. Still a good find coming from Bayang. Very unselfish. Short on the uh, little eight-footer para kay Senator Bongo. And as Coach Ronnie mentioned, an 18-point lead. Para po sa OP uh, executive. 6-0 here in the second quarter in terms of scoreline. 
them down. Right, this is going to be a foul on uh, number 12, Malaga. Malaga will check in on the OP executive. Guevara loses on the floor para sa kanila. Lapid. Change direction. Malaga drop pass. Piston. Finally goes on a field goal para sa kanila. It's been a while. Only the third field goal para sa Senado. Their first hit in the quarter. After being scoreless in the first three minutes and a half. <laughs> Nothing from the three-point area. Office of the president. Again, Malaga. Again to Cison. Well defended. Uh, with the presence underneath. Para sa mga nakapute, ano? Hirap na hirap mga ng basket underneath. Or any basket for that matter. Guevara. Overshoot. They're reminding you na... First game pa lamang po ito ng, uh, ng Senate. And there are seven teams. So yung ating uh, first round, eh, taga-anim na laro po sila. That will determine kung uh, sino ang top four. Napapasok sa Senate. Yes. Just the bottom three. Finally, Senator Bongo knocks it down. Top of the team. This is first four attempts. Knocks in the first three ball for today's collision course laban sa OTPMS. Lapid. Guevara. Empty possession. They get it back though. OP executives. This is lose. Back to Guevara. Palatao. Kick out muna kay Lapid. Lapid. 12 footer, no good. Here comes Senate. Let's see if they can go back to back. And we mentioned it earlier, Coach Ronnie, medyo streaky. Itong si Coach from Aki Senator Rocker. Bongo, he hit one earlier from top of the key. Ngayon naman sa may bandang right side, another three-pointer para kay Bongo. Timon 3, 1, 2, 3! Nice action. Back to back three. Pagula dito kay uh, Senator Bongo. Nai baba ng sampo. Yung kanilang deficit. Malaga. Kicks it out to Andaya. Here he is again. Elbow. Jump shot. No. Di nakit back ni Malaga yan. An empty possession para sa Senate. Malaga is doing the right thing. Pushing the pace. Trying to set up his teammates. And give them open look. Alata could not handle that. Alvarez. Alvarez will try his best yes. to ram his way inside. Oh, oh. Big boy. Six point run para sa Senado. And back to back three balls para kay Senator Bongo. Lapid, kick out muna dahil masikip sa may ilalim. Palata all the way to the top. 
Dalawang free throws yan para kay number 19, Palatao. Nice side stepping move yes. coming from Palatao. Second opportunity para sa Senado. Bayang with us those eight points dito sa ating ball game. And suddenly the Senate will outscore OPPMS. But in the quarter, eight against six. Zero out of three so far from the line is Palatao. Uh, great hustle. Magmula kay uh, Lapid. Back to Palatao. Keep this possession. Shot clock is six para sa kanila. Sanyosa. Rainbow three-pointer. No good. <laughs> That's it. Lobo, Lobo. Here he is again. Senator Bon Bon. Three in a row, Coach Roy. Single-handedly uh-huh. rallying the troops. Down 24-8. 16 points behind. Now only behind. By now. Third three-point basket. Talagang, Coach Roy, ikaw alam mo yun. Pag nakaisa ka, maganda na pakiramdam mo eh, no? <laughs> this is what we're seeing. Ano, nakakapagod yan, ha? Totoo, totoo. Kasi dami na rin yung tinitira volume, eh. Saka popwesto ka para tumire. Correct. Improving position, continuous movement. Senator Bongo, three, uh, three three-pointers in a row. And I will miss his, his own version of a three. Isang volume scoring lang yan. Meron ka namang porsyento. So, itira mo, itira mo. Tapos, uh, just look for that decent... <laughs> Parang ikaw, ha? Damiyo mo na na. Makakatama ka. They're down by just single digits. Uh, nine points itong uh, Senate. Definitely an, an immovable force underneath itong si Alvarez. Uh-oh. Big boy, eh. That's, that's easily 200 pounds. Uh, Coach Ronnie. 5'11 frame, probably. Another basket, Magbula kay Big Boy. Alvarez, double figures na siya. He has 10 points in the ballgame. And certainly not the last. Uh-oh. They, they go to him a lot sa may ilalim, Coach Ronnie, you know. Andaya. Three-pointer from the left side, no good. Lapid. Nice pass. Oh, yes. Pero maganda na naman yung kanilang uh, nakababa kagad sa defense sa mga asul. Problema, they're, they're having problems with their offense. Sanyosa's three-pointer, no. Sanggalang all the way to the top of the field. One against four, no problem. 13 in the quarter para sa kanila, 10. Para sa mga nakaputi. Bayang playing a big role para dito sa OP executives. Empty possession sila. Here comes, here comes. Senate, pwedeng ibaba ang kanilang deficit. Well, he hit three in a row, pero ito, nag-miss na si uh, Senator Bong. Oh, deep speed, do! Hindi <laughs> <laughs> ko magat-ampek, po. Ah, pero, uh, well, some breaks going their way pa rin. Empty possession naman para sa OP executive. What a boost. Pagmula dito kay uh, Senator Bongo, pumasok. Hit three three-pointers. Pinagpahinga muna. Sen, pahinga muna. Sandali, kailangan namin yung... yung second na pole. Second na pole, Sen. <laughs> Sen, sa second half, kailangan ka namin. Tatlong three-pointer na si uh, Senator Bongo. Palatao to the cup. No, here's Alvarez again, creating that space underneath. Ano po matapat sa kanya si Malaga? Kasi bata ito. Oo. Maski maliit, malakas. Tama. Kikita sa mga katawan eh. Ron of Gold, the corner screens, getting ready to check in. Uh, bago tumuloy yung action, meron muna tayong timeout. New NTV Cup will be right back. Sir Mark. Uh, DJ. DJ Chico, you last. Okay? 
Ante baligtad. Yung bangkay dito, screenan mo, sir. Okay, chikoy tayo. I ano mo lang to, seal mo lang. Okay. Akin ang three. Ikaw ang three, okay. Wala naman tayong one minute. Wala naman tayong isang minuto dito sa ating first half. What a quick basket. Magbala sa Tony Executive Sanyosa. Nagkaroon tayo ulit ng uh, isa pang timeout after that 12-footer ng uh, OP uh, Executives. USTV Kapo, mga kabalik. Fifty-one seconds remaining. This I think first half controlled by uh, OP Office of the President Executives up until a minute. Si Senator Bong Go Malaga now all the way to the right side. This is the corner three. Empty possession of Senate. Lead para sa OP uh, executives, 30 to 19. Problem was a uh, a drought, eh, no? Coach Ronnie, in the first quarter, hindi makakuha ng, ng uh, baskets ang uh, Senate. That's why very much in control dito ang OP. Oh, but, uh, they ended the yeah. first quarter 2 of 16 from oh, the field. Oh, eh. 1 of 7 from the line. But here in the second quarter, they have uh, 5 field goals. Yes. At tatlo dyan ay 3-point baskets. Oh. Much, much better. Sportsman like pa lang itatawa. He has to be taken out. So much things are happening inside of the floor. I did not see what happened, Coach Ronnie. Sanyosa will be trooping to the bench. Dahil yun ang technical foul siya. Sportsman like a no foul. Kaso wala yung free throw is hanggala. 11 point advantage babawasan ba yes he does and maganda dito they will keep possession so some breaks both sides of uh, Senate Malaga nag right in front of me and Coach Roddy big possession para sa kanila before we go into the break before we go into half time Flamignano corner three pointer tips in Sanani Zangalang Ronald Golden kick out muna. They have a fresh shot clock naman. 10 seconds to go. Malahag has to take shots. Uh Oo. -oh. Hanapin na yan. But I mean, di ba? He's young. He's muscular. Pagkita niya rin. Itira na yan. They have 5 seconds to work with. Ang game clock natin is 8. Flaminiano, the left-handed stroke. No. 4 seconds. Mayang knows it. Uh, that will end the first half of action. This is our executive face of Senate contra OP executives. A 10 point lead for OP executives at the half. Your TV Cup will be right back.
Nagbabalik po ang UNTV Cup. This is our halftime break. Our halftime score is 30 to 20 in favor of the OP Executives. At kung kanina tunghayan po natin ang team preparation ng OP Executives, ngayon naman silipin natin ang team practices ng Senate Sentinels. Check this out. Nagbabalik sa executive face-off ang team ng Senate upang makabahagi sa Play for Charity Basketball Tournament ng UNTV Cup. Yung ultimate goal namin, yung maganda nga yung makisalimuha o namin ulit yung mga other government agencies. Saka makatulong din sa charity. Secondary na yung mag-champion. But, but we will play hard to win. Yung uh, vision nga na ni Kuya Daniel, napakaganda, di ba? Na, nakakapaglaro ka na, nakakatulong ka pa. So, yun din naman gusto ng mga executive natin na players. Lalo yung mga senators natin. Uh, naglaro sila, nag enjoy Then, helping uh, others also through, through basketball, which they love the most. Siyempre, kami lahat excited. Alam mo, sa Senado nga, sa lounge, pag uh, nagkakaroon kami ng usap-usapan ng mga senador, lahat kami parang we have been praying for this uh, moment and opportunity na talagang ma-open na puli at uh, magkaroon kami ng pagkakaabalahang iba naman dun sa trabaho. No? Para sa Sentinels, ay bahalaga ang regular na pakikilahok sa sports activities para sa kanilang physical well-being, lalo na kung makatutulong pa sila sa kanilang beneficiary. Nako, napakalaking bagay na to kasi alam mo, lahat kami dito sa Senado, ano eh, naniniwala dun sa tinatawag na work-life balance. Napakahalaga na merong uh, opportunity ka para maging active, para mag-engage into sports, exercise, and at the same time, yung uh, mental health mo, no, lalo mong nai-improve because of uh, these activities. Kaya talagang saludo kami sa UNTV, saludo kami kay Kuya Daniel Rason at sa bumubuo ng UNTV Cup. Kaya talagang makita mo yung mga public servants, they are always uh, looking forward to this opportunity na magkasama-sama, yung camaraderie, yung fellowship. Alam mo, priceless yan eh, no? yung pag nagigita-kita kayo ng kapwa mo public servant at uh, nakaka-inspire yung bawat isa, yung pag-uusap uh, lamang sa gilid-gilid ng basketball court. And of course, siyempre yung fun no, na makikita mo with uh, some sort of competition then pero masaya pa rin at the end of the day masaya so yung moment na uh, it take mo yung opportunity na magpahinga na magpakondisyon mag-exercise ang laking bagay no ang sarap na feeling na i-inspire kami dahil yung yung liga natin hindi lang basta liga laging meron nakikinabang may nakikinabang na beneficiaries at uh, syempre yung uh, camaraderie ng bawat isa uh, yung mga senators, lagi nag-uusap kahit na, oh, lahat kami, parang pag nag-uusap, lahat kami out of shape dahil ang daming pinanggalingan, no? galing pa ng pandemya, etc. But uh, uh, bagamat na kinakalawang, etc., nandun pa rin yung joy and the excitement to be together, work out together, at uh, mag-exercise na magkakasama. At higit sa lahat, eh, nabibigyan tayo ng opportunity para showcase yung skills natin, mahon yung skills natin, at uh, maging party tayo ng napakagandang adhikain ng UNTV Cup executives. Well, ano, uh, we've been practicing twice a week. And then, uh, siyempre, medyo executive na nga natin. So, medyo mga elder statesman na yan. So, balik lang kami sa basic skills, konting conditioning, and then that's it. And then, yung, yung, yung uh, patterns naman is uh, unti-unti lang namin introduce sa kanila. Uh, regular practices is after office hours eh. So, kita nyo ngayon, mga magsiseven na, di ba? So, ganong oras kami para na sa ganun, lahat makapunta. And then, uh, lahat makapag-participate. And then, uh, very, ano naman sila, cooperative naman. Halos every practice is present lahat. Nakakatuwa. Nag-concentrate ang coaching staff sa conditioning ng players para makasabay sila sa takbuhan sa hard court. Yeah, more on ano kami kasi, uh, basic drills lang. So, Dribbling, passing, shooting, and then counting uh, cardio workout, and then we also do some flexibility uh, drills para sa mga sa kanila para maju malusen up naman. So malaking bagay kasi yung for almost three years ni tayo nakapaglaro. So ngayon medyo hindi natin binibigla, uh, mahirap naman bigla yung mga executive players natin. Counting conditioning uh, pag uh, hindi nakakapaglaro, siguro gawa lang ng counting uh, stretching at saka mga exercises sa bahay. Yun lang. Uh, kung kaya yung uh, tumakbo ng konti, 
Konti, pero siyempre dinadaan din sila. Dahil ano eh, kaka-50 ko lang, kaya medyo nag-iingat na tayo. Hindi uh, natin masabi, no? dahil uh, ilang years na rin kami hindi nakapag-participate dito. So siguro, kahit makapasok man lang sa next round sana, yun ang initial goal namin. Uh, win a few games, tapos uh, kung kaya, sana makapasok sa later rounds. Uh. More of ano talaga, conditioning. No? Conditioning, uh, building yung ano, chemistry ng team. Uh, maraming uh, bago, no? including ako, from the uh, previous executive team. And uh, yun, kailangan talagang uh, mag, uh, magkaroon ng chemistry. Kaya saksihan natin ang pakinipagtag na isa ng Cardinal sa hardcore in the spirit of camaraderie and care. We shall see how the Senate Sentinels will be able to bounce back in the second half. Pero bago po yan, ang ating halftime performer, huwag po kayong aalis sa pagbabalik po yan ng UNTV Cup. Halftime festivities. This halftime entertainment is brought to us by Katie, our music house company. At this evening, po, we have invited a singer songwriter who started performing at the age of nine. He performed back to back with Ben and Ben, Four of Spades, and Mayonnaise. His debut single, Mean Sun, is out now with KDR Music House and Will Bros Alive. It is his second time to perform here. Let's all welcome at center court, Jarl. Magandang gabi, Nova Desi! Magandang gabi sa inyo lahat! Gising pa ba? Isang hiyawa naman dyan! Gising pa ba? Yun, gising na gising pa at buhay na buhay pa. Ngayong gabi, ako po ang inyong last performer at kakantahan ko po kayo ng isang kanta. Nakaka-release lang po la, uh, two days ago. Ang title po nito ay Minsan. Sarili ko po itong likhang music na to. At ito po ay isang love song. Ano ba tong minsan? Minsan ay para sa mga taong nakakasama mo lang ng saglit. Minsan mo lang siya makasama. Pero dun sa minsan na yon, naramdaman mo agad na may connection ka sa kanya. No? Mer, sino ba nakaranas nun? No? Mga saglit mo lang nakasama pero parang may spark agad kayo. No? Ito yung minsan na pagmamahal. So here's minsan by Jarl. Again, I'm Jarl. <laughs>
Minsan ka lang lumapit sa akin agad kong napansin Ang perfectong uhis ng iyong labi Minsan ka nang tanungin Kung pwede ba kitang mahalihin Sa may hindi at ikay kinikiki Minsan ka lang naman ikaw magkasama Kaya ka natin lumaming alaala Nangis ko nga na biro mo Idinadaan sa tawa At kung minsan Ikaw na papanaganipan Ikaw lang na naaalala Kahit may problema At kung minsan Ikaw lang ang nakikita Na para bang kumikin ang atala Sa kalangitan Minsan kay hirap isipin kung wala na ikaw sa tabi O minsan kay hirap isipin kung hindi na may babalik ang yakap mo't halip Okay, so uh, what keeps me keep, keep motivated is uh, the music itself. Okay, so the music itself, kasi early as uh, nine years old, ito na yung ginagawa ko, ano? So ito na yung ginagawa ko. So what drives me is parang I want, my goal exactly is I want to, I want to change something in music. I want to create something new. So yun yung lagi kong gigil na gigil. So gusto ko magawa ng music. So this Minsan is actually a, uh, a culture of a old and new music together. So it's a collaboration of an old song and a new song, new song vibes. Okay, I know that you have upcoming events as well. Please yes. go ahead, promote it in your social media pages as well, Jarl. All right, so hello guys. So I hope you liked it. So the title is Minsan, okay? So uh, please follow me po uh, at This Is Jarl Instagram, Jarl Facebook page, at This Is Jarl TikTok, ayan. Okay, so uh, meron tayong incoming events. Uh, on Tuesday, sa Good Morning Kuya tayo. Good Morning Kuya TV. And on Wednesday, sa Wish Bus na tayo, guys. So please follow me. Thank you so much po. And thank you so much for the KDR family. Thank you so much all. And my Wilbros Live Management family. My Kuya Winston Llamas and Learni Llamas. Maraming salamat, Jarl, and we hope to see you once again here at the UN TV Cup game. As mga kasambahay, once again, Jarl at the halftime. We'll be back for more action right here at the UN TV Cup games.
third quarter action. Magumpisa na po. Senate versus Office of the President uh, Executives. Kontrolado po ng OP Executives from the get-go. Lumamang na nga ng 18 po ng ating first half. Pero, nabago na ang tema. Yes, dyan. Coach Ronnie. Dahil nabuhay na si Malaga at kumunekta na si Senator Bongo. Yes, barrage of three-pointers. Taplo. Magmula sa kanila. Actually, yung kanila mga three-pointers they have only made three all care of him. But that's uh, Warrantan on your screen. Siya matatawagan ng foul dito. Si Big Boy ang mag-free throws para sa OP. This is Alvarez who has uh, top scores para sa kanila with 10, with 10 points. 20 points, 19 rebounds in that first win versus JSRS. Uh, winning by 44 points. Pero dito, marami rin ang uh, bala sa front line ng Senado. 24 points, Coach Ronnie, no? 20 points. Ah, sorry. 19 rebounds, pero 44 points win. Oo, oh, 44 oh. points ang uh, ang kanilang inilamang towards the end. This is an 11-point uh, OP executive lead. Care of that gentleman, that young man right there, number 22, Marvin Bayang. Coming to the game, quick six points kagad ang kanyang uh, inambag. Follow it up with another layup. He has a total of eight. Warantan na bitawan. Three seconds na lang remaining. Dapat di na nag-foul. So this is gonna be... Ah, hindi, walang free throw. Sideline na mga throw. Hindi na wala naman sa... Hindi naman titira siya uh, sa galang. Malaga, the jumper. Coach Ronnie said he has to try to look for his offense. He does. We talked about the need for Malaga to take shots and be a scoring threat. Yep. Nice 12-footer baseline. Magmula sa kanya. Kevara's three-pointer can't seem to hit. He cuts to the basket. Nothing there. Single digits na naman ang deficit ng Senate dito. Nine points. Oh, hindi nakastart si Sanyosa dahil had to sit out the first three minutes of the uh -huh. third quarter. Because of that foul called against him earlier. Gebara. Gebara. basket from about four feet. Nothing outside, something inside for Gebara. Oh. But an 11-point lead. Oops. Sanggalang... Dinay pasok yung uh, Jimmy, Senator Bongo. Looking for his 4-3 ball. Yes. Marvin Bayan, no. Put back Palatao, did not work. Here comes Malaga. Looking for Sen. Wow. Ah. Ganda yung ano eh. Ganda rin talaga yung kanyang pitik eh, no? Dino 10 footer magmula kay Senator Bongo. 11 points for Senator Bongo. That's 11 of the 24 points of the Senate. Only 50%. As Bayang works hard in the open court. The try and lift 15. To another double digit lead. It's Marvin Bayang. Sa sa mga matitinding uh, mga weapons para dito sa OP. Uh, Executives. Pinakamatinding weapon sa open court. Uh -uh. And he has to reprise that again after uh, six quick points in second quarter or late in the first quarter. Ganda ng kanyang uh, contribution na rin dito. Double digits na. Parawan, nothing there from the uh, arc para sa Senate. Warrantan will get an offensive rebound. Senator Bongo. Pero they get an offensive rebound. Pero nawala ang bola. Malakas ang pasa. Tinig ni Marvin Balang sa kalama. Here comes Malaga. I totally agree with you, Coach Ron. He has to just try to put up some shots. Hindi maganda siyang porsyento. Kanyang uh, perimeter jump shot. Hanapi niya na ng gusto. Yung uh, kanyang opensa. And there it is. Short lang. Warrantan, offensive rebound. This is going to be second chance point para sa Senate. Yeah. 
travel. Malaga siguro parang uh, somebody tied him up. Tapos sa uh, uh, tinawagan siya ng traveling. Mapupunta tayo sa side ng OP. Executives. Palatao. Guevara. Marvin Bayang. Here he is. Attack middle. Palatao. Meron tayong pito. Oh, we're going to the side of Senate. Still down by 11, which is much better than their 18 point deficit in the first half. My nice Scott, Hindi lang maka finish. Sangalang will get blocked by the presence coach Ronnie of uh, Alvarez. Alvarez, no, sa ilalim. Alvarez has been a workhorse for the White Shirts, both on offense and on defense. Left hand and stroke, nothing there. Ito ang wala sa OPPMS pag wala si Sorosa. Yung kanilang uh, perimeter offense. Tama. He has a couple of, he has two three-pointers na rin dito sa ating ballgame sa Sorosa. Manageable pa naman itong uh, 11 point Senate uh, deficit. Sanggalang. Sen, Bong, Go, Pabandan, Tira, that is open on a Sunday coach running. Uh, Senator Bongo exploded with 13. Hard earned points after missing his first uh, six attempts. Oh, oh. struggle yung kanyang una, di makakuha ng basket. And then suddenly, three straight, yung po nangyari. Malaga in and out triple, siya natuloy ang nagbaba ng bola in between the legs. Nice cut, nice cut. Nicely done. Senate. This is the quickest unit para sa Senado. I need to show. I mentioned earlier, kasamang Jolly. This team was a good lineup. I've seen them play before. Okay. Ganda, ganda ng cut. Ganda ng cut. Exacto yung pasa. Finished basket magmula kay Parawan. Bonus free throw coming up. The seven point deficit can become six on a made free throw. There it is. The closest that they have been after being behind earlier. After a 7 0 start of this contest, para sa yes. naka white shirts. Mayang, ito na siya uh, sa Nyosa, who hit a couple of three pointers para sa OP executive. And then, big boy, Alvarez underneath the basket. Does not settle for jump shots. Diyan lang siya sa may ilalim. Malaga, kick out to Sen Bong. No. Good offensive rebound. Hindi pa pumasok. Putting, putting it up strong. Lies will be fouled. Lapping out positioning. The normally immovable force underneath na si Franz Alvarez. Lies rather. He's missed uh, several free throws already. Yeah. Hoping makabawi dito sa kanyang second free throw la is... Rims out pa rin. Zero of two in, uh, sa trip na yun. Marvin Bayang, kick out to Sanyosa. They have been waiting for his return dahil siya ang uh, kanilang perimeter player. Three point... Uh, Specialist that's number 26 among the Kapute has two three pointers in the ball game. Good dive to the basket. Alvarez got a good presence. Lies underneath. Shot clock is 10. Lots of time for a bucket para dito sa OP executives. Three pointer. Dina ipasok ni Guevara. Sen Bongo Parawan Wow, a long one Pero short ng mga pagkakataong yun Here comes Marvin Bayang Hindi na kinailangan Magpapin ang board Second player in double figures Para sa kanila Bayang now with the total I believe Of uh, 12 points Hindi tira ni Malaga yan eh. Mid-range. Uh, uh, uh. 
player itong si Malaga yes. talaga. But probably also gassed and winded. Dahil kanina pa niya pinipilit itakbo okay. ang pace ng Senado. Uh, you're looking at the scores. Scores here, Coach Tony. Yes, si uh, Alvarez top scores with 13 para sa OP uh, executives. Marvin Bayang with his 12 points. Sanyosa with his 8 There he is, Sanyosa. On you. That's the value of Sanyosa. Yes. Third three point basket for Sanyosa for 11 points. Nice and back to the basket. Left hand and lay in Malaga. Grimacing as he went downstairs. It's <laughs> The fresh legs of Marvin Bayam, pero nothing there. Oh, look at nice heads up play magmula kay Alvarez Guevara. Nothing on the three-pointer. Lands in the hands of Senator Bongo to Andaya. Three minutes remaining dito sa ating third quarter. Senator Bongo short on the three-pointer. Nice offensive rebound. Hindi na put back. They, they'll keep the ball, Senate. No! Nice lead pass. Ooh. Ill advised pass. Pero ang tumama sa mga paan ng defender. I think that is Adaya. They'll keep the ball. Office of the President uh, Executives. Still an 11 point uh, lead para sa kanila. OP. Guevara three. No. Forty-two to thirty-one. Two and a half. Mike Fermin and the gang over at the, the Senate. Oh. Eight was the closest that they were earlier. Sorry, six at 35-29. Now they cut it down once again to eight. Oh. Senate defenders, pero dito Senate sent it out sila Ojori. Quick response, no? Para sa office of the president uh, executives. Keeping their uh, head afloat. It makes this third quarter uprising ng mga nakasul. Antaya three-pointer short. Alvarez, Sanyosa picked it up. To Alvarez, two against one, three against one. Nawala ng tuluyan ang bola. Andayas, all the way to Malaga. Malaga, all the way to the top. Nalabas pa yung kanyang tira. One against three for Malaga, no problem. Now, this is a very manageable... Eight point deficit lang naman. Sanyosa will try another three. Medyo malakas lang ng konte. So far, two free throws coming up para sa Senado. Big free throws dahil uh, nagahabul sila dito. Again, down by eight. Is uh, the Senate. Lang it at the free throw line for the Senate uh, Sentinels. Big free throws for Sanya. This is the third quarter. Palapit ng palapit. Yes. Just a two possession deficit Correct. para dito sa Senado. Bola. Uh, minute and eight remaining. It's having third quarter. Again, reminding you na yung uh, OP executives is 1-0 uh, na po dito. Ito ang very first game ng Senate 
Sentinels season. Langit will lose it. Ito na Sanyosa and the uh, office of the president. Lose will stop. Oh, oh. nice. The Panther Pira from the free throw area. Difficult. 39 seconds. Only the third quarter. Nice, nice pass. Very nice pass. total of eight points. Second leading scorer para sa Senado. Six points scored only in the first ten minutes. But uh, Senator Bongo has changed the course of this team. Luz turns the corner. The free throws coming up for Luz. So once upon a time, this was an 18-point lead for the office of the president uh, executive. Senator Bongo. Chipping away, chipping away ng konti, konti, to the center. Ang kapnaib ba ng ani? Pero pwedeng going a three possession ball game on a made free throw dito by Luz. Can make it seven or even eight. Ayan na nga. Bottom of nila tang kanyang una. Three points for Luz all happening here in the last part of the third quarter. Short on the second. This ball foul on Lapid. This will also result in two, two free throws. Oh, both teams are in. Both teams in the penalty goes thrown in, no? Yes, yes, yes. Mark Lapid na tawagan ng foul at ayan na nga, Sanggalang will through to the uh, line. Just clearing that up. Yeah, tama, si Mark Lapid na matatawagan ng foul dyan. Sanggalang first free throw, hindi papasok. These are big free throws para sa kanila para makahabol dito. They're down by seven. Senate Sentinels. Sangala. Free throw. No. Mark Lapid forward to lose. Nambea matatawagan ng foul. This is gonna be free throw. Again, both teams are in the penalty. Kita natin yung sundot. Okay, ang matatawagan ng foul. Nagahanap pa lang isang scoring look dito ang blue shirts. Uh -huh. Luz doing well here in the fight. Total of four points para kay Luz. Restoring an eight-point lead para sa office of the president. He gets it back. Paulino, emergency shot, hindi po papasok. That will end yung ating third quarter. A full ten, ma ten minutes ahead of us. Don't go away. You at TV Cup, magpapalik po.
fourth quarter action. This is UNTV Cup, the executive face-off. Mga executives po ito ng ating mga agencies. And uh, this is the Office of the President Executives versus the Senate Sentinels. Na first game pa lamang po ng Senate Sentinels. They're down by only eight. Last ten minutes po ng ating ball game. Let's see. Marawan. Nothing there from the baseline. Picked up by Langit. Lona Golding. Malaga. They need... His heroics, Coach Ronnie, di ba? Malaga? Well, if there's one thing that OPPMS needs to contain, it has to be Malaga. But they have uh -huh. to stay away from being in penalty quite early. Yes. And, uh, kumbaga, not fall every time may a-attack. Uh -huh. eh. Well, we're going to be in Actually, both teams in the penalty early. So, nagkaroon mga free throws. Malaga will miss a... Uh, the, uh... Front end. Ang kanyang mga free throws. Ang pangalawa, bottom of the net. Dito na lang, ang kanilang hinahabot. 7 for Malaga. Erickson lose ng OP executives to Marvin Bayan, who's been playing very well para sa kanilang. Melento will lose it. Lose. Alino. Malaga. He can really look for his basket. Send, bomb, go, short. Malaga. Over the top yata yun. Or high there. Foul coming from Luz. Erickson Luz. Second goal foul coming from Luz. Magkaganon kahit out of position. Pero pwede kong alaki yung Malaga eh. Hindi siya matatawagan na foul. Kahit over the top. Kasi kahit kaya niyang sungkitin eh. Langit to Malaga. They need his baskets. Bongo. Fourth, fourth three-pointer, if I'm not mistaken. And they breach the six-point barrier and lead down to four. Bongo, ah. 16 points. And four made trippers. In unti, unti, Coach Ronnie. This was an 18-point OP executive lead no second quarter. Pero si Malaga ang ano rito talaga. Ang nagdadala. Kailangan ano na yung... No conscious shooting. <laughs> Masa itira na yan kasi, di ba? Malas mga katawan. He has that percentage naman. Nako, OP executives will lose it. Here comes San Bongo in the Senate. Ball six. Nasa palpal siya ni Melencio. Erickson lose. Marvin Bayan, that's going to be a blocking foul. Blocking. Okay. Ginilid niya yung sarili niya eh. Uh -huh. Ronald Golding sinakripisyo ang kanyang pangangatawan. Standing right there. Ano gone either way? Oo. Uh -huh. Kasi para na ka-establish na si Boss Ronald Duna. <laughs> And well, referee's decision. It's gonna be free throws para kay Marvin Baya. First free throw, up and knock in. We still have a four-point lead. OP executive. Second free throw is in. Marvin Baya. 13 points in total. Malaga, ganda ng drop pass. Ronald Golding basket. Malaga attracting all sorts of defense. Bring up his teammates from the weak side. Kaling naman ni Golding. Kaling ilalim. Nice footwork for the big man. Turning back the hands of time. Uh -oh. Still getting some baskets. Complete the three-point play. One possession ball game. Two points na lamang. Ang kanilang hinahawal. 7-1 here in the fourth quarter. 
Wow. In terms of scoreline, pabor sa mga nakaasul. Eight minutes remaining sa ating ball game. Hindi pwedeng wala si Sarosa sa loob. Oo. Uh-huh. Ayun na, they need... Sanyo, Sarado. They need his sniping. Yan, siya may hawak ng bola. Back to uh, Marvin Bayan. Marvin. Malakas ang kanyang three-pointer. Big boy Alvarez picks it up. Will they get second chance points? Last shot. Kick out. There's your guy, Sanyo, sa... Sa may ilalim. Malakas! Another foul given up by the white shirts. Some breaks going the side of uh, the Senate Sentinels. An empty possession para sa OP executives. Can tie the game right here or even take the lead on a three-pointer. Paraon. To Malaga. Dinrap pas kay Langit. Langit. Loses the ball. Para silang binuling ni Alvarez. <laughs> Karambola. <laughs> Tumbay yung dalawang asul eh. Laki ni, promise 200 pounds ito si Big Boy. Si uh, number 7 to si Alvarez. About 5'11 or 6. And then we just got built like a truck. Two points, ang inahabol na lamang ng Senate dito. Pero bola ng OP. They need breathing room. Yan na nga. Yan na nga. Ang binigay ni Marvin Bayang sa kanila. 15 for Bayang. No doubt the best perimeter player para sa white shirt. Yes. Bongo, three pointer is good! Wow! 19. For Bongo. <laughs> On the side, yeah, yeah, yeah. three-point baskets. Nakakatuwa. He just loves the sport. He loves playing. And he loves shooting threes. Pero a quick response pag mula kay Alvarez. Sa may ilalim. Again. Only the second field goal para sa kanila. Uh-oh. Alvarez now with 15. Tied with Bayang. For scoring honors sa uh, OPPMS. Parao, Ronald Golding had a nice basket earlier. Center Bongo all the way to the top. A footer, no good offensive rebound. Malaga was trying to put it back. Will get fouled in the process. Big free throws for uh, Malaga coming up. Big lang naging ano, no? Big lang naging dikit. <laughs> Ang ating ball game. Misses yung kanyang unang free throw. Ray Malaga's free throw number two. Nako. Parehang hindi na ipasok. Here comes the gunner para sa OP executives. Marvin Bayan. Sanyosa, their sniper from the three-point area. Pero this time, hindi pa pasok. Malaga will clear. Here comes the blue shirts. Two left. Marvin Bayang with those quick feet and those quick hands. Palatao's three will not work. Tanggalang clear. Senator Bongo, bibigay mo na kay Ronald Golding. Relax lang, relax. Lots of time, five and a half. Ray Malaga, back to San Bongo. Spots. No good. Big offensive rebound. Sanggalang, pero nawala. Marvin Baya. Nice play. Uy! Sarap yun. He was wide open for that. Ay, pagod na rin. Ang taga... Play, he playing. He's playing heavy minutes. Ito He's playing uh, really hard. Oh. 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 Alvarez. Lost his footing. Oh, he, he was fouled. Oh. Okay. Merong contact, kaya pala yes. nawala ang kanyang footing. Here it is right here. Oh, parang may natamakan na ata siya. It's gonna be two free throws para sa kanya. Yung, uh, pero ang ano, yung uh, Office of the President uh, Executives ang nasa 
penalty to the Kings 23. Oh, make it 14 fouls for the Senate Sentinels. They need breathing room. At yan ang binibigay ni Alvarez Angela with that made free throw. France Alvarez splits. Ray Malaga all the way to the cup deny pass. Oh. France Alvarez again clears. He has a bunch of rebounds as well. Palatao attacks Ronald Golding. Oh! You know, in a half with me, both Ronald sacrificing his body, Coach Ronnie. Definitely a defensive specialist. Well established. Yes. No in contact. Yes. Just a three point deficit para sa Senado. Chance to reach even closer as we have crossed the halfway mark of this final quarter. We go out, huh? we go out. Huh? Janel, Tashi, JR. Okay? Send bong, hindi yung send bong, ha? Hey, Pat, dala dito. Okay, nakatunod ko yan, ha? Dala. Pag ginaw ka, Bogs, tignan mo ka agad. Pag bigay siyo, lumapit yung defender, ayun ang send bong. Pag lumapit, eto yung lumapit, JR, dive ka, baka magbigyan ang send bong, ha? So, nakatuan to formation tayo, ha? Pat, one side, Bogs, send, send bong, Janel, saka si JR. Pag nabigay, Junel, dive, tingin, pag quick, kaya tayo siya. Pag wala, balik ka sa... Action resumes. Dito sa Nova Desi, we are in Novalicia's executive face of Puito. The executives of uh, yung ating mga agencies, oh, of yeah. Office of the President Executives versus the Senate Sentinels. Kanilang bola, nakawasul po sila. Ray Malaga. Napapalubutan ng tatlong uh, defensa. Nawala ang bola. Nawala din sa OB uh, executive sa bola. Back to uh, Senator Bongo. Sangarang. Short ang kanyang baseline. J. Ray Malaga. Again, three white shirts on him. The three throws coming up. Bong go, dalawang free throw. First trip to the line for the senator. 20. Huge points for Senator Bong go. The only player in double figures para yes. sa Senado. I think he has five three-pointers. Hindi ko nagkakamali, yeah. Five three-pointers dito sa ating ball game. Down by only two is his team, the Senate Sentinels. Wow, Nelson Luz. Big three pointer for Amanda. Seven for Luz. It's a pabas. <laughs> Short in Tirania, Sen Bong, Gonu Pagakataong Yon. Ah, pero four points run, four point ball game. Three minutes and 25 remaining. It was a big basket coming from Luz. Last momentum was fast, uh -huh. swinging to the flip side. What's uh, the, the juncture? Ito, parang ano sila, no? Parang may sagot sila sa mga <laughs> baskets ng Senate Palago. Well, loving uh, that glass. Pastor. 
earlier also off the off the glass yung three pointer ni Erickson Luz na yun pastor naman yung kanyang free throw second no good lane violation five point difference lamang dito lamang ang uh, OP executives ten points in the quarter para sa kanila trese naman para sa senado Sangala. Short. Sanyosa to Erickson Luz. Forward now to uh, one of the most important players is uh, Franz Alvarez. He throws it off. Well, both teams are in the penalty. But every time we hear a whistle deeper, it's going to be free throws. Franz Alvarez has uh, 16 points and 4 rebounds. Oh, definitely more than 4 rebounds. Oh, oh okay. Nakita mo naman, kanina pa naminitas yun. Mga natay po dito yung mga tropa ko. Pero, Paparoni says here, on top of all of this, he has 4 steals. Ah, huh? uh, this is Pastor with uh, the free throws. Paraon. They need a basket. Big possession ito para sa kanila. Nothing from Langit. Sanyosa. Great pointer is good. Umalago na naman. Up by 8. 7-0 run. Yes. Para sa OPPMS built around two three-point baskets and a converted free throw. Out of harm's way, but definitely still a long way to go. With 2 and 37 left here in the final part. Two minutes and 37, uh, 37 seconds remaining dito sa ating ball game. Umabot na na nga. It came, it, it came down to a two-point difference na lamang dito, pero some nice baskets coming from uh, OP uh, executives. Naging walo na naman itong kalamangan. They need this. They need it. Ten balls to go with yet another three-pointer. 24 for Senator Go. Uh -oh. 18 points from the three-point line. 37% from the free ball. And just like that, we're back in the hunt. Marvin Baya kick out to Pastor. Nice rebound, making sure clearing. Somebody has to keep an eye on Senator Go. Oh, my. Running to the basket underneath. Great point, Coach Ronnie. Diba, the top scores, he has six three-pointers. They have to know every time kung nasan siya. Siyempre, mamaya yan sa kanilang uh, opensa. Pastor ng Araro sa ilalim. No. Here he comes again. San Bongo, sporting number two. Top scores para sa kanyang kupunan. Paraon. Ray Malaga. A minute and six remaining starting ball game. Here he is again. Uh oh. <laughs> Kicking foul is uh, San Bongo. Big stop. 
Big Interesting stop. call, referee. Yeah. <laughs> 61 to 58. There's still just a no, single possession difference here. Coach Rolly, tatlo lang yan. Ayan, may kita na. May kita ko may slow mo dito. <laughs> it looks like, a, looks like basketball motion to me, but... <laughs> Palatao attack, no. Here comes France Alvarez back to Palatao. Three says. Ah, in town. He didn't one more dribble. See si France Alvarez. Eh. Palatao didn't let him pass. Eh. I'll say this again. Somebody has to keep an eye on Senator Gray. Gray Malaga. Camilla. Nothing there. Dahil uh, may presence sa mga nakaputi. Palata we go all the way to the cup dapat. Inaattack niya muna yun. 26 seconds remaining. Senator Bongo, three-pointer, no! Oh, wow. Kaya inadverted yun, pero Palata just lands on the head area of Lies. Lies uh, a little bit shaken up. Nako, siya pa matatawagan ng power. Sa palataw, lumahan din sa parting ulo niya. Ang buti na lang, it seems okay. 18 seconds remaining, we have a timeout. We'll be right back. Two possession lead para dito sa OPPMS. Here we go, Coach Ronnie. Uh-oh. Traveling pa si Ray Malaga. Naku, what a time for a turnover. They have to play the fouling game right now. Uh-oh. Yeah. So, 14 seconds remaining. Tama ka. A quick foul. Of course, go, try to go for a steal. Muna. Foul, foul. Ray, you have to foul right now. <laughs> Touch foul ni uh, Sen Bongo. We send uh, Marvin Bayang to the line. Even if he makes both, it's, just, it's still going to be just a few possession difference. Dahil apat lamang ito. Free throw number one. Up and in, Marvin Bayang, five-point advantage. Even if he makes his second, anim pa rin, so two uh, possession ball game. Titignan natin. Second free throw. To the right. Here we go. It would be nice for them to have to uh, look for a three-pointer right here. Ray Malaga all the way to the other side. Send bong God. Not there. And uh, of the present executive will win this one uh, to go up to two wins and no losses. 63 to 58. First game for the Senate Sentinels. They are at 0 and 1. Coach Ronnie. 
big, big basket and some critical free throws coming from Luz, Alapiao, and of course, uh, the steady presence of Alvarez in the day for the OPPMS. Yes, they were almost overtaken in the end. Yeah. Mainly through Senator Bongo. But eventually, Baya and Alvarez steady the troops. And I thought that Saros had some key defensive stops. Mosanyos had some key defensive stops to preserve this all important uh, second win for the OPPMS as they lead right now. The tournament standings after dealing their Senate and the Senate defenders the first loss of the competition. We will turn you over to Rina with our co best player. Maraming salamat sa inyo, Coach Jolly Escobar and Coach Ronnie Magsanok, our two best players of this ball game. From the OP executives, we have MJ Bayang and of course, uh, Sir Franz Alvarez ng OP executives. So, nahing na po si Sir Franz Alvarez. Sir, kamusta po kayo dito? Welcome back dito sa ating UNTV Cup. Of course, ano po ang pakiramdam that you're back in action, back in the basketball games po? Uh, masaya, syempre. Lahat tayo mahilig mag-basketball. Kaya laking bagay na bumalik na po yung UNTV executives. At isa kang laro po ulit. Balita ko po kay Coach Fernandez kanina, hindi po kayo nabubuo as a team here, no? So, paano po yun? Uh, do you do your own uh, personal training po or personal basketball po? Yes, um, pag hindi nakakata ng practice, lahat kami nagkanya-kanyang sikap na makapagpapawis at makastay uh, in shape. With the MJ naman, no? I noticed kanina meron kang uh, bandage on your knee. Kamusta yan? Anong nangyari dyan? Actually, last uh, year, I suffered uh, ter- a torn meniscus, pero... Hindi ako makalayo sa basketball. This is something that I love since I was a uh, high school in high school. So, talagang bumabalik at bumabalik. Bahala na para lang makalaro lang. This is something that you love, but how do you balance your work, uh, your work schedule, your family time schedule, pati yung pagpapractice sa basketball? Time management lang, especially right now. I'm a newly um, minted father. Kakapanak lang ng asawa ko noong March. So, uh, time management lang and pinapayagan kasi ako ng asawa ko talaga mag-basketball. So, malaking bagay sa akin yun. Of course, go ahead with your greetings po, Sir MJ. I'm sorry? Go ahead with your greetings po. Sino ba ang mga gusto nyo batiin? Uh, to my wife, Jules, and my son, Theo, I love you. See you later. Salamat sa pagpayag niyo sa akin. And to our ABL basketball team, alam ko nanonood kayo, team namin ni Kong Chikoy. Malapit na tayo maglaro ulit. Maraming salamat po, Mr. MJ Bayan. Of course, uh, Sir Franz uh, Alvarez, sino po mga gusto niyong batin at pasalamatan? At sino ang kasama niyo ngayon? Siyempre, kasama ko yung Lucky Charm ko, yung panganay kong anak, si Ali. And siyempre, gusto ko i-greet yung mga family ko, nanunood. And siyempre, lahat ng kababayan ko sa Palawan. Maraming salamat po to our two best players of this ball game, Sir MJ Bayang and of course, Sir Franz Alvarez of the OP Executives. At dahil po dyan, ito na po ang ating updated team standings as of today. Nanguna po dyan ang kupuna ng OP Executives with 2-0 on their win-loss record na sinusundan po dyan ang PNP Responders, AP Cavaliers at Judiciary Magis. Itong tatlong kupunan po natin may 1-0 dun sa kanilang win-loss record. Ang Senate Sentinel sa 0-1 ang GSI Furies at Ombudsman Graph Busters na may 0-2 sa kanilang team rankings right now. Of course, angat na po sa ating semifinals round ang kupuna ng PNP at NHA. Makakalaban po ng PNP ang kupuna ng Judiciary Magis at ang NHA naman po ang kupuna ng AFP Cavaliers but they will be back in action sa ating semifinals round two weeks from now May 3 po yan. Pero ito na po ang ating game schedule next week April 30 at Napaco Arena. Executive phase off muna tayo sa ating triple header on a Sunday sa ating game 1 maglalaban po dyan ang kupuna ng Judiciary Magis contra sa Ombudsman at sa ating second game it's the Senate Sentinels going up against the GSIS Furies on our main game that day it will be the AFP Cavaliers going up against the PNP responders. Don't miss out April 30 at the Paco Arena ang ating UNTV Cup Executive Face-Off. Sa ngalan po ng lahat ng bumubuo ng UNTV Cup and in behalf of Kuya Daniel Razon, my name is Rina Villamar Camera. Thanking everyone for supporting UNTV Cup Season 9. Good night, everyone.